Happy Wednesday, everybody. I hope you're doing well. Did you see it? Did you hear it? In case you're unaware, this morning or earlier in the day, uh, MLB The Show tweeted out the first official trailer for MLB The Show 22. And spoiler alert, if you don't want to hear it, click out, like right now. And if you're on Twitch stream right now, like close your ears for the next five seconds. Ryan Howard and Randy Johnson are two new legends in the game coming this April. And if they're dropping those two big stars right now in the first trailer, that has me really hyped to see who else will be in the game as we get legend reveals and streams and in inning programs. It's going to be a whole lot of fun. Let me just refresh everything on my end real quick and head on over to chat. How are we doing, Bunk and Packers? I hope the two of you are doing well welcome on in air happy wednesday to you too randy johnson i appreciate you bunk welcome on in packers hello angel howard and johnson i if i thought facing chris sale was hard in these games with that slider oh i am not ready to face johnson and his slider that's not gonna be a lot of fun but i'm so freaking excited for it randy johnson hit a bird oh yeah that's right randy, randy johnson hit a bird moment in coming in coming for the show 22 could you imagine if they add that rj how are we doing survive welcome on in i saw your tweet angel awesome awesome stuff how are we doing josh welcome on in phil had to buy a playstation 5 controller since it's been drifting a lot definitely need one for 22 luckily looks like you helped yourself out over there Steelers with the 11 month resub to kick off stream today. Hi, Ashley. How are you today? I am doing really well, Steelers. How are you? Thank you so much and welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. I hope you continue to enjoy those emotes and sub badges. Thank you for the continued support, Steelers. Emotes in chat for you. I hope I hope you're doing fantastically. Randy, I, I, see, I think most of you are more excited for Randy than Howard. I'm, I'm a little concerned concern there for ryan howard but i'm glad you're all excited dodgers showing love to both of them how we doing red sox guy welcome on in sports i do know the me bot in discord has been off and on the last couple of streams it worked two streams ago it didn't work it did not work one stream ago we'll see if it works today you always have to give it a couple of minutes but uh we'll see i've been trying to mess with it and when i think i fix it i haven't i, I think it's just the me bot at this point welcome on in o town how are are you doing ryan howard is your favorite player he was on the phillies let's get it ashley did you see my tweet yesterday about the podcast tonight the good luck tweet yeah i saw it uh anything about that packers fan that you'd like to elaborate on randy johnson how are we doing mo rip mlb 22 controllers you're not wrong benny how are you doing today can't wait to give up off bci homers using randy johnson to ryan howard is that better yeah i think that's better hopefully pci is fixed though or else uh, i'm gonna cry a lot uh randy equals danger absolutely how are you doing falcon ryan howard equals david ortiz who equals prince fielder who equals tank thomas with slightly worse hitting attributes change my mind well we shall see it gives some more flexibility variability and of course if you're a phillies fan you definitely like the howard choice welcome on in bts how are we doing dresslin i'm doing really well how are you what is up Ader? i'm so sorry to hear about that for your mom i really hope of course she feels a lot better very very soon thank you red Sox. I think you Packers fan. You need Simeon at second. Tar Heel. How many times do I have to tell you? Mookie Betts is that dude. Mookie Betts is that dude. But I hope you're doing well. Dresslin with the 60 bits. Emotes in chat for you. Thank you so much, Dresslin. I hope you're doing well. How are we doing, Tar Heel? Good afternoon, Mason. What's up, King Review? Welcome, welcome, welcome. As you can tell by the title by now, we are going to keep playing some ranked seasons today. I felt very good after pulling on Monday and how we swept the day on Monday. Hopefully, we can sweep the day today. That would be awfully sweep. Get it like sweet, but instead of the T at the end, it's a P. It's a pun, people. A pun. Bunk with the hydrate. Dang, bunk. I almost gave out a free hydrate. But how is everybody doing real quick before we load into a game? It looks like Felix Hernandez is going to be our starter in game number one. He's on the chopping block, I guess you can say. Unless you all want me to try out Jake Arietta. Uh, we could try out Jake Arrieta, but Felix has been doing the job for us, so I kind of want to keep Felix in. I have not tried out this Jake Arrieta card. Keep in mind, we are still on the all-star rating, 
So uh, obviously different pitchers do differently on those ratings. Of course, Jake is nasty, says Air. The best pens are always the ones you have to explain. Oh, of course, big oof, big oof. You're calling two smaller legends and two new big legends soon. I like the prediction, Angel. Use Nolan. Should we start a game with Nolan Ryan? The thing is, is I'm pretty terrible with him. Um, I think these are just a couple. Oh, the he, this was just our friendly games. These stats were just our friendly games. I guess I could use Nolan on All Star and get away with it, but uh, I really don't want to. I could get a free rage quit out of it though. Some people just see Nolan Ryan and they quit out uh, right away. You can always put Mookie in if. <laughs> could you? Oh, in left field, you meant to say right field technically, but yes. Jake was crucial in your World Series run. What's good, K. Brian fan? Welcome on in. What's a pun? Never heard of it. Dresslin, don't be hurting my feelings this Wednesday afternoon. That's not very cool of you at all what uh which two new smaller legends and two new ones are you predicting angel i would be very curious to see about to play some ranked verlander starts out the rank day for you best of luck with that aider is there a new br or such this week so if it sense so out of its sense i said i have no idea what that second sentence is trying to say phil what's up big dale how am i feeling about the reveal trailer i am feeling hyped if they put howard and johnson in the first ever trailer imagine what's going to be coming up um i will check out br real quick to see when the new season is starting oh it already did there's already a new battle royale season i'm assuming it probably started yesterday all all recycled rewards of course nothing new in terms of cards and content but there is a new program to work towards so we can possibly start that uh maybe next week i do want to play ranked for as much as possible because uh I love my ranked seasons, of course. As always, I have to say this at the start of every stream. Don't stream snipe me. It's not worth it to have to ban you if you stream snipe me. Obviously, though, um, sometimes you just match up because you match up. I will always offer a friendly quit. I don't play stream sniper because literally it's an unfair advantage to you over me. And then secondly, if you want to play me, if you want to get a little 1v1, I've been hosting friendlies every Friday since January and will continue to do so every Friday on stream until MLB The Show 22 comes out so if you want to play me you will have an opportunity literally every single friday until the show 22 comes out hope we don't break them gotcha gotcha i mean i've been out of it since i stopped playing apologies no worries at all phil just trying to make myself giggle haven't been able to in a while hopefully all is okay dresslin welcome on in game i am a rankaholic i i do really enjoy rank seasons even though it takes years off of my lifespan those weren't the only two throwback players in the trailer you think they're the two new legends though raider but yes there were previous throwback uh players in the trailer grady sizemore uh, made an appearance once again um, but he was new to this year's game so he's not considered new for the show 22 you'll be over you'll be over in five minutes sounds good wrigley hope i'm not opening a can of worms with this but what is stream sniping just what i said avid in case you caught that stream sniping is trying to purposely queue into the same game that i'm queuing in and so then you can watch stream and um get all the insight into my gameplay it is quite an unfair advantage advantage toxic ashley is needed i can't wait two more days i haven't decided if this Friday is going to be toxic or not. I don't want to overdo the toxic friendly Fridays because I don't want to like take away from it. So this might be normal friendly Friday this Friday, but a uh, toxics will have at least one or two more uh, before the show 22 comes out. Of course, Grady the goat size more. I see what you did there size uh, wrestling. OMG, Rainy Johnson and Emily 22. He better not be a bum like Pedro. Yeah, I think after this year, they know how to scale those milestone cards, especially. And when a good time to release certain like hits per nines and so on and so forth so uh, we'll see what happens might be an upgrade to chris sale that's exactly what i was saying at the start of the stream jh 100 a freeze off that is that is tough Ader. i did not catch and sorry to make your make you repeat yourself did you hear it the second time i said it avid i can say it a third time but i did say it twice uh but no worries at all absolutely it looks like Raider also helped explain it. That should definitely help. Brady said, never say never on a comeback. I, I don't know where that came from. He is retired. <laughs> Yo, got that quit out. Let's go, Aider. First small legend would be eric chavez okay 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 randy johnson could have a mile johnson should have a milestone card for killing that bird rj you're really on that bird topic <laughs> but then of course the perfect game <laughs> I'll open a can of kick butt i believe in you sports all right first game of the stream we're going felix hernandez i definitely prefer if any of these pitchers i have to 
start on Hall of Fame, it's Felix. Um, he usually gets crushed on All-Star, so we'll see what he can do here. We are the home team. A lot of P5s in my opposition's lineup. That's okay, though. Because throwing motion, but as a 102 outlier with 6 feet 11 frame. Quite a tall guy. Some had him a crochet <laughs> with 7 inches. It's just so funny. There's apparently more searches on Google for Randy Johnson bird than there are for Randy Johnson baseball. Okay, that is pretty hilarious. 100%. First real game. We have a decent team, but not too good. You got this, Aider. I believe in you. We are underway with a dot to start off this ball game. We love to see that. Dot, dot, dot. You don't need a lot, but in baseball, you absolutely do need a lot. Uh, sorry, my elementary school art teacher, but uh, we're all about the dot, dot, dots. And that's a nice little fly out for out number one of 27 for my opponent. Let's go survive. What is something that you want to see in 22? Legends, game modes, customization. Feel free to rant. Personally, I would love to see an integration of the Negro League players like Cool Papa Bell or Satchel Page. Pop in a 105 mile per hour. Satchel Page fastball would be amazing. I am right behind you on that as well, Ray. Absolutely. freaking lootly As for new legends, well, I know he's been in the game before. I really want Carlton Fisk to come back. I really do. I, I was not playing when Carlton Fisk was in this game. I was just playing Road of the Show. So I, I would personally like the original Pudge uh, to find his way back into the game, if you will, when it comes to new legends. Day, what's up, Post? Day 770 of alcohol-free, only like 40 years to go. Can we get some hype? And let's go, emotes, in the chat, heading towards Post way. Post is... It's hard to make post plural and pronounce it correctly, but I think you all know where I'm going with here. Congratulations, post. Keep the streak going. You have done an absolutely outstanding job thus far and continue to do so. I hope you're very, very proud of yourself. That is quite an accomplishment. Carl Yastrzemski, yeah, so about Ted Williams? Oh, what if we had Ted Williams in this game? Give me Jeter and you're happy, says Sports. Randy with Outlier and Pinpoint? That's a big yikes. Me and the homies love Randy Johnson. You're not wrong, Spider, you're not wrong. I'm sorry, my opponent. I'm trying to read chat. I can't pitch to you in time. Give me a second to catch up, everybody. Saw last night the new BR came out. I didn't know till later in the day. It's okay. I didn't know until about two minutes ago, JH, when I checked it. We're just dot, dot, dot in the corners to start today's game. We might get a rage quit if this is a strikeout. Okay, it's, it's a ground out. But it's a one, two, three inning, and I will always take the rage quit, of course. You just got Eckersley from the third inning boss pack. Let's go, let's go. Carl Yastrzemski is one of Angel's predictions. How we doing, Jordan? Great game from Giannis and the Bucks versus the Lakers, 100%. My favorite Randy Johnson quote is him saying he didn't need guns in his house. He just kept a bucket of baseballs by his bed. I believe it. I believe it. Joe and Dom DiMaggio, especially Joe DiMaggio. Oh, come on, Tommy. That's going to stay foul. Thank you. Seven bombs from Acuna going to P5. Let's get it, Matt. That, speaking of what I want to see in the show 22, I want to see organization of your parallel cards in your inventory. I want to be able to organize by P5s, by P4s, P4s, P3s, P2s, P1s, and base cards. Um, I, I would very much like to have that organization included in our inventory. What's up, Big Ed? Welcome on in. Been two years here. Big congratulations to yourself. I hope you're doing well, and welcome to the stream. You want Satchel Page? I don't blame you. What's up, Grizz? You need some Mets cards. Cards? I can't swing today. Like Jose Reyes, David Wright, Carlos Delgado, or Johan Santana. I like it, I like it, I like it. Jeter better have bronze defense. Joe West, 99 card. I would stop playing this game if that was a thing. Who, Joe DiMaggio? Never heard of that guy. Mm -hmm. If Delgado's in the game, he would be a J for sure. Hopefully clean up the check swings. Oh, you are not wrong, Big Ed. You are not wrong. I should be doing a lot of damage in this game right now. Getting a little bit at- I thought I checked it up. Check swings, yes. Thank you. Um, we should be able to put up a lot of runs here. Just need to settle in. Definitely hyped, very hyped for the start of today's stream, given the two new legends announced in that trailer. Or not even announced, indirectly announced, if you will. Um, so let's just uh, stay even keel on the pitching side of things and then have a better approach from the bottom half of this inning, of course. How do you feel if you get stubs for a P5 card in 22 as, in a, as, in a, as a reward? I think that'd be actually pretty, pretty cool. 
5,000 subs a card at least. I know they don't want to overinflate it, but I actually would like that, absolutely. Yo, what's up, Ritz? Happy Wednesday to you. I had no idea until today that you can change the PCI to a starfighter shape from Star Wars. Bloody brilliant. Oh yeah, there's a lot of customization on your PCI. And yes, that is one of those options that exists. So I'm glad you got a kick out of it. 2-0 opponent, this is off to a horrible start. There's nine innings in a baseball game for a reason, Aider. It's not over at the start. You got this, my friend. You got this. We need Yogi Berra. Yes, Tar Heel. I really, really like that suggestion. Joe DiMaggio, you want him back as well? Understandable, of course. What if SDS threw an Eddie as a troll card? Will they put Adrian Gonzalez back in the game also? Adrian just retired, right? Uh, so they should not have his rights. So that Whoa. that's going to be a little interesting. King, I see that hydrate. I'll get to that in just one moment. They should give you parallel points. Wait, what is going on? He's in there. Why did three of my fielders have no idea what to do on that play? This game confuses me sometimes. King with the hydrate. Happy Wednesday, Remarkable. Starfighter's the PCI you use and you love it. Let's get it, Dresslin. It is Wednesday, Red Sox guy. Or are you referencing that, like, that one commercial? I forgot which commercial it was with the camel, if I'm not mistaken. They should give you, back to Dale's comment, parallel points for a player of the game, like 10 or something. I like that. Yeah, if you have the player of the game, you should get a little PXP bonus. I like that idea a lot, actually. 99 Kirby in 22, you can hope. Gonzalez hasn't appeared in 2019, it's a two-year gap. Absolutely. The Rocker, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. All right, let's 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 chill out a little bit and have some better at-bats here. Does that count? Does that count as a better at-bat? Huh? Huh? Don't you... I stand corrected. I thought that was clearly a home run. I was wrong. Are you now the bubblegum pirates? No. No. Just the Chicago bubblegum. That's another thing you want 22 to fix, says Nick. That one does hurt, Larry. How are we doing today? And then I strike out. Dang it! What is up with my plate approach right now? Bet one of them was Mookie that didn't know what to do. No, you would know. Simeon would know. Wait, no for what, Tar Heel? You'll go home in PR. I need to lay oh, off that curveball. Right now, that curveball is not doing me any favors outside of the zone. Hey. Let's just be careful here. That was that yeah, was yeah, sad. Oh, Thank you for all the RIPs and the oofs, because I, I don't really know what that was exactly. There we go. That one is not going foul. Bryce Harper crushes it to right field to start the scoring of the game. Let's go, Bryce. 422 feet local gunfighter with the three month resub thank you so much i believe stream oh, elements and the yeah. alerts i don't know why but sometimes they're really delayed for some reason hopefully it pops up very very soon but thank you so much local and welcome back on into the sand squad sub family i hope you continue to enjoy those emotes and sub badges and thank you for your continued support I appreciate you. Hopefully Stream Elements isn't off for very long or else it's going to be a long day for the alerts. That's my MVP. Hey, Bryce Harper, National League MVP. You're Okay, that should have been crushed. That should have been crushed for a pitch, for a homer. Okay, I don't know why I'm swinging at literally every single pitch, but that is what I'm doing right now. That is what I'm doing. Ryan, how a card do you think would be in his Milestone 58 Homer signature or awards card? I would think it'd be a Milestone card. They, they really enjoyed their Milestone cards this year. I don't see them slowing down in that aspect. So if there's an opportunity for a Milestone card, I think they take it. I think they take it. That should not remain catchable. Good, 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 good. See, we were settled down in that Bryce Harper at bat, and we, we were able to crush the pitch. Gotta settle down in these at bats and continue to keep rocking. Imagine facing Johnson with a 105 mile per hour outlier. Don't even, don't even, I don't want to. There it is, local. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. So it looks like alerts are going to be a little bit on the delayed side of things. I will keep an eye on that going forward. What's up, Derp Dog? Welcome on in. Chances are slim, but I want a Dallas Braden Mother's Day perfect game card. I'm just a big fan of his. I respect it. It'd be cool to kind of get cards like that, you know? Players who are not very well known, but had a terrific... Um, 
day in their career that could be emulated into a usable card in this game. So I think you bring up a pretty good point there in that comment. Oh my goodness, Mason. That's a tough hit to give up. I will say this, there's no reason why I should only have one, one, one run in this ball game. I'm gonna make it up to you all. There's no reason I should only have one run uh, right now. You got this, Aider. You got this, you got this. Pay attention to your game. You don't, you don't have to update us every second in chat. That is an out. Boom, I, don't run on me. It's not worth your time. It's, it's just, it's not worth your time. You just lost your one and only base runner of the game so far. One Let's go. Tati Senior, two, yes, exactly. Two Grand Slams in the same inning milestone card. That is something that we could really, really use in this game. Could you imagine? That'd be pretty, pretty cool. Tommy, Tommy, how? I love this game to pieces, but how did he not smother that baseball? Safe. There is no reason my opponent should have any runs in this game. <laughs> so um, I'm going to make sure it stays that way. Got him! You know it, Ray. You know it. Tati Senior and Junior, Griffey Senior and Junior. Well, we do have three of the four cards already in this game. Tati Senior is the only one of those four who's not yet in this game. They would have to give him 250 power somehow. Absolutely. Don! How are we doing, Don? I'm personally doing well. How are you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ryan Howard is from St. Louis. I did not know that. Pretty dope facts. If y'all are Office fans or The Office fans, can't can't forget the the in The Office. Um, the character Ryan Howard um, is based, his name was stolen, if you could say, from the baseball player Ryan Howard. Look it up if you do not believe me, but that is why his name is Ryan Howard, if you know the character Ryan in The Office. Because, uh, the baseball player Ryan Howard. Second small legend? Ma oh, yes! This is yes! Matsui would be absolutely incredible, Angel. Let's not give up a Grand Slam right here. Oh, Felix my. is struggling. Odds are Jake Arrieta might end up replacing him at some point, but I, I do have a lot of faith in Felix Hernandez. And it's not his fault the game loaded the bases for my opponent on especially two of those three swings. Obviously, that last one was a walk. The cam yeah, exactly, the cameo, exactly. Ryan started the fire. He didn't start the fire. That's a strikeout. Don't you dare give him the check swing. Thank you, ring him up. Ring, ring, hello. You're out. <laughs> At home, your day off. Let's get it done. I hope you're enjoying your day off. Joe West, not 193 career ejections milestone card. Oh my God. Oh my God. Come on, Yasmani Grandal. Triple for your Trey Turner. Let's get it. As manager milestone. I, I like all the milestone cards y'all are coming up with right now. Nick with the hydrate. I got you, Nick. I need to settle down with my at-bats. Randy Johnson makes me a happy boy. Welcome on in, Clay. Randy, jo Randy Johnson makes us all very, very happy. I feel like he's overshadowing Ryan Howard, though. <laughs> What's up, Dodger? Welcome on in. Why can't I lay off that curveball? Why can't I lay off it? I think they should do manager cards that affect your team's overall stats. Then Earl Weevil, e Earl Weaver comes and curses out the umps. Could you imagine? That would only elongate the game, though. I think if the manager actually did that. But the po but the the attributes to your team is something to consider. What's up, Dodger? It'd be cool if you can kind of make a cap manager. And then you can work on your manager to help improve your team, if you will. How about a milestone for Pedro Martinez throwing a senior citizen to the ground? Oh my goodness, dodge with the hydrate. Now the hydrates have been redeemed. Let's try not to spam those going forward. The bunk already said that. Thank you for taking the words right out of my month, right out of my uh, mouth there, bunk. Way out in front of that changeup, unfortunately. Can't wait for the new game. Go Cardinals. How we doing, Rye Guy? Go White Sox. I am so incredibly excited. What did you think of the trailer this morning? That trailer was really, really cool. Bring on 22. My body is ready, says Ritz. It better be. All right, come on, Tommy. I need a good at-bat from you. Get some two-out damage going. 
Get some two wow damage going. We're so early on our swings though. That's the unfortunate thing right now. Manager cards would be fun in general, says Dale. So it's a general consensus in the chat I see. He checked it up. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, full count for Tommy Edmund. Let's get it here. Barry Bonds bases loaded intentional walk milestone card. Tommy does need to make up for that ball. I agree, survive. Looked great. Let's go, Rye. Glad you enjoyed. And we're chasing high heat. And Rai guy, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. This is a game that I don't know why I only have one hit. I'm going to settle down and, and hit the baseball. It's actually a little comical at my end that I am not hitting the baseball the way that I should right now. No, no manager cards, please. For the love that all is holy. No, says Dresslin. Wonderland's in the show 22. Cannot wait. Do I think the strike will end soon? That's a very good question. I hope so. Um, but if the owners aren't willing to budge one bit, it's it's going to be a very long time, unfortunately. Mike Matheny would have the lowest overall in the game. Nah, that'd be Tony La Russa. Uh, at like a 32 overall manager card. Second big legend, Frank Robinson. Let's get it. Can we get a milestone Mike Grady? Oh, what's up, Beaver? Angel Hernandez, three overturn call game, 99 milestone. Y'all really want those umpire milestone cards. So what would you do with them, though? Oh, Someone could just manipulate the umpires in the game, and then that could mess around with the calls at the plates. I don't know if I would like that. I do like that dot, though. Your opponent is r 2 That really, really stinks. That means they're toxic. They could do some cool stuff and do player managers. And Dusty Baker player and manager cards. That would be very, very cool. Do I play with the Goldie card? I do not. The Goldschmidt card, I'm assuming you're referring to. I do not have Paul Goldschmidt in my lineup. Personalized umps? Oh, please no. Please no. What's up, Nyx? Welcome on in. Hope you're doing well. We're just started. This is the first game of stream. I'm doing well on the pitching side of things, but uh, <laughs> I need to be more patient at the plate, one could say. That's true. It's not a strike. It's a lockout. They're different. Yes, this is a lockout put into place by the owners. Good, good, good point. You have a feeling there'll be only be baseball. We'll see for a while. Hopefully it's not survive, but there's obviously a chance, of course. That curveball. I don't know why, but it's it's I'm not seeing the curveball very well. In fact, if my opponent just wants to spam the curveball, they would probably get away with it for another couple of innings, to be honest with you. Yes, the 99 Angel calls pitches in the zone balls. Outside zone strikes, screws up plays at first. I, I would rage quit if I saw my opponent with that card then. That is exactly what I would do. I checked it up. I didn't even swing. Thank you. Finally, they're recognizing me, barely tapping my controller. And giving me the benefit of the doubt. That curveball, I'm telling you, I can't lay off of it. I got called for that swing. I swear to God, I don't know why I can't see this curveball. I'm actually kind of frustrated now. <laughs> I should be able to, I should be hitting this curveball so many times for home runs. And I just can't. I just can't. You're honestly mad at the addition of team uniforms this year? Dresslin, what? Why would you be mad at that? <laughs> Baseball must happen. I agree. Yo, what's up, Dayquils? Welcome on in. Feels like a personal attack. It is not. I promise you. It is not. All right. Come on, Junior. <sighs> one of these days, the swing will put the ball into, into play. Stop chasing! It's the high fastball and the curveball! I need to settle down! I'm so much better than this. What are we doing? What are we doing? You love Team Uniforms of Diamond Dynasty? I agree 100%. Yo, what's up, Ty? Welcome on in. Best of luck in your competition. Y'all just ever ask yourself the question, why do you He's suck out. right now? That is that is my question. Sharky! With the 20 month resub, whoop whoop, another month running. Sharky, thank you so much and welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges and emotes and chat for you, my friend. Thank you for 20 freaking months. That Founders badge always looks so good. Thank you so much, Sharky. I appreciate you. Yes, yes, I do, says Coach. 
Okay, at least it's universal. Cause there's there's no reason this should be a one nothing game. I, I should have mercied this person by now. And this is no disrespect to my opponent. It is me literally just criticizing my gameplay right now. Uh, I asked myself that every game, what's up, flying? Not gonna lie, I actually would like Angel Hernandez and Joe West in the game for franchise mode. Just give the game more flavor. Absolutely. That's the question I ask myself constantly, says Dresslin. Ashley, do I think owners lock the players out after Marcus, that big seven-year seven -year contract? Do you think he deserves it? The owners locking the players out has nothing to do with that Marcus Simeon contract. I promise you. It was because the CBA um, was expired. And they decided to lock everyone out and then not initiate any conversation for, what, six weeks? Six weeks it took for the first meeting? Oh, no, what happened, Valencia? Talk to us. Decided to hop in on my lunch break from college classes. Let's go, Dayquil. I actually just got home from my classes about uh, an hour ago. So we are thriving. It is always hard to play this game after class because I literally come home, I eat really quickly, and then I start stream. So if I would have had a little bit more time to warm up, maybe I would I would have more than one run on the board. We're just gonna go to second base here, go with the momentum. Let's add some runs now. Yo, what's up, yo? There are different humps in the game. Oh yeah. This woman was arrested and charged with starving five dogs to death and for destroying the house that she lived. She was found not guilty, excuse me? Yeah, you better go fight. Call me up, I'll, I'll come as well. You have it's 20 strikeouts a game. I hope, I hope your pitcher's the one that's averaging the 20 strikeouts a game, not your batters. That is, that is horrible, Valencia. Absolutely horrible. I hate people. A lot of the times. The announcers say who's officiating? Gotcha. I, I always have the announcers turned off. Just, just for the focus and concentration of a competitive gameplay. Yeah, 100% Valencia. Found guilty of destroying the house, but not the dogs. Uh, aren't the dogs a part of the house and then her responsibility? How how do you present evidence that she didn't do it? That is incredibly wild. Always down for a little violence, says JH. Who's gonna show up in court sometime before you know it, Jay? Always call her. You know, pure analog sucks, but I can't adapt with buttons and zone. I would definitely recommend it. Even if it's just five minutes of practice every day flying Ferrari. I think at the end of the day, it's going to help you a lot. That seemed like a 60-40 ball that was called in favor of the pitcher. Okay, hi. Hello, Brandon. Hello, Valencia. Thank you for joining us today. Pure Analog is better for franchise? Is PCI Pure Analog? I believe it is. Maybe it's not. I don't know. I can't hit the baseball. I can't hit the baseball. There's no reason why I shouldn't have 10 runs on the game in the game right now. I'm, I'm very frustrated with myself right now. I just need to slow down. I might have to ignore y'all when I when I hit next next half of the inning. Just just to regain that concentration and focus. <laughs> Cuz there's only been one hit and it was for a homer. So at least we got the home run. But there's no reason why I shouldn't have several other home runs following that hit. I'll get there, okay? I'll get there. People are nasty, they absolutely are. The lady worked for a rescue the same way H.H. H. H. Holmes ran a hotel. Oof, that like gave me goosebumps. I remember hearing about Holmes for the very first time in school and I was like, what? That's a dot. At least we're dotting it up, you know? At least we're dotting it up. Yo, oh, gotcha, RJ. I do enjoy watching your games. I should turn my announcers off. Made me laugh the other day that they said the ball is like the ex-girlfriend who's not coming back. That is a very appreciated saying in this game amongst the community. It is quite funny. All right. Let's see if we can get that double play going. I want to keep Felix in the game. He He's done everything in his power to keep this a shutout. Um, when my batters can't seem to be doing anything on their end of the plate. Their side of the plate, I should say. So hopefully we can see some improvement here in Felix's pitches. And that will help V nice with the tier one sub V. Thank you so much and welcome on into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges and thank you for the support. Emotes in chat for you, V. How are we doing today? Thank you, thank you, thank you. What's up, Matthew? Welcome on in. You have the devil in the white city on your bookshelf downstairs. I still need to read it. Uh, Holmes is an intriguing and very messed up human. 100%. Hope all is well. Gotta get my badge game going. I love it, I love it, I love it. Glad to hear all is going well. Welcome on in today. Brent, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. We are, it's the first game of stream, and let's just say you can tell it's the first game of stream. Hopefully, we'll settle in uh, very, very soon. 
It's not looking too good right now. Use Ashley as my announcer problem solved. I got you. I got you with the announcer. With the announcements from the announcer, Ashley. That's a hanger. You got a homer on that pitch, my friend. Oh my goodness, Brandon. Oh my goodness. Tati's junior best White Sox? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all always have to bring that up. Every single stream, why don't ya? Every single time. Michael Jordan best White Sox of all time. There we go, average. That's what I like to hear. I have not, Big Dale. I am waiting for my spring break. Because if I get in now, I won't pay attention to school. And that is obviously not... I. What are you doing? Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh my god. It, it, it... It automatically went to the left fielder. It should have went to the center fielder with that territory right there. I'm not sure why. So I was trying to change my pitcher, change my position player while still oh making progress toward the baseball. Y'all, if I'm if I'm this off, I don't know if I'll be able to play any more games after this one. Which is a lie, because I am going to play a lot more ranked season games after this one. <laughs> But they're not going to go very well if I'm playing like this, unfortunately. Uh, friend Vel, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Yo, what's up, Brent? Great to be here with you. Stoked to be following. I appreciate you, Brent. Do you come from a different platform? If so, hello, hello. If not, welcome, welcome. I guess I'm repeating myself right now. How is it going, though, Dale, with uh, Legends Ar Arceus? I hope it's going well. Oh, my God. I'm way too early on every single swing. I I'm human, Dodger. I miss messages. You can always feel free to resend it like you did here. Best of luck with the conquest. For tips, I recommend going to the Pacific Northwest first. I find a lot of success a lot of success uh, when you start in the Northwest of that map. Oh, Yasmani, what are we gonna do with you? Any homers yet today? Yes, Bryce Harper to the pool, Jeru. Uh, Twitch, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. The Pigeon Brothers, welcome, welcome. The Pigeon Brothers. My apologies, I did not see the letter R there. No, to be honest, I'm not seeing a lot of things right now. I'm not seeing the baseball very well out of the zone. I want to swing at that curveball every single time my opponent throws it. Will the Show 22 oh, allow no. users on PlayStation 4 to build their own stadium? I'm bummed that you can't. They will not. You will not be able One to ball. build your own stadium. It is a feature exclusive to next gen. There's obviously a hardware... Um, there's obviously hardware in next gen that can support it that the current gen does not have. So it's exclusive to the Xbox Series S and X, as well as the PlayStation 5. The Switch was not able to do it either. Um, off stage, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Can't let the Mariners get into a rhythm. They will take over the world. Avoid the Pacific Northwest like the plague. No, that's how you're supposed to do the conquest. All right, who's buying me a PlayStation 5? Is there there's like a birthday coming up possibly? We, we shall see. Wouldn't want it to. It would wreck your console. What would wreck your console? A stadium builder? It does not at all. I promise you that. I know, because I've been using it since it came out in the game. And uh, my oh, PlayStation one, 5, yeah. knock on wood, is doing pretty well. After this game, I am going to go into custom practice, though, because I need to be able to oh, distinguish good, a ball yeah. from a strike. I have not done that at all today. So that's what I'm going to do. It would on a PlayStation 4, though. Oh, custom- what are you all talking about? Am I missing something? Like, custom stadium mode would wreck your PlayStation 4? Hey, there we go, CB. There we go, there we go. Ball match outside. Man, are we good. Should extra inning program stay? Uh, XP inning program stay? I really liked XP innings. I'd be fine if they stayed versus, like, the level format. Don't swing at the first pitch. Honestly, Phil, that's- that's what I have to do for right now. Absolutely. No, there we go, Aider. I'm surprised they, they sent the friendly while they while they were up in the game. It's a good person. That would not be me. I would take that win all day every day. <laughs> uh, but that is really, really nice, Aider. Eric, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Can I please get this free out? Eric, you distracted me. But we got the out, so you're good. You're good. Welcome on in. Birthday twins, y'all. There we go, Henry. There we go, CB. I love to tell fake stories. JH, what is your next fake story? You bought the MVP edition? Let's get in, Matthew. Thank you, yo. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My brain is very sporadic right now. I, I want to pay all of my attention to all of you and not this game. And right now, <laughs> it's not helping me in this game. But we'll, we'll take what I can get right here. Unreal, right? Yeah, my PlayStation 4 is a fragile old man. Nice characterization. 
Oh, he can't handle custom stadiums. Oh, Back in his day, we only had 30 MLB, 11 classic, and however many minor league stadiums. Oh my goodness. That is incredible. We'll just go to first base right here. Easy. This is where we put up like 10 runs, right? <laughs> Eight to one is the difference in the hit column. My batting average is gonna tank after this one. I'm doing really well, Victor. Victor, how are you? I bought the deluxe edition for Switch just to take advantage of the goodies for DD when I can use the Game Plus Cloud Gaming. Let's get it. Friendlies are only considered before the first pitch. After that, it's game on. That is my personal philosophy as well, Brandon. That is crazy, CB. Do you know what also is crazy? The My neighbor across the street from me, he's a year younger than me, but he also has a December uh, 31st birthday, which is pretty cool like what are the odds of your neighbors across the street having the exact same birthday just one year apart pretty neat stuff if you would ask me oh you got it dresslin let's walk it off we need a 10 nothing score we gotta put up nine runs to do that oh uh, come on that's gotta sneak through for a hit you would think what's up spicy thank you for the follow welcome to the sand squad Whoops, wrong emote. Am um, I doing no money spent for 22? Yes, I always do no money spent for 22. I, I appreciate the grind 99 aspect of the game. So I will continue to do that. In your opinion, what is the best thing to do day one of the game? Offline. Uh, whether that's Conquest, Team Affinities, I would always recommend they always have the, the stage one Team Affinity that drops with the game. That will help you get cards, that will help you get stubs, that will help you get XP. Um, I will be working on uh, Team Affinity, unless something else changes. Thank you. Thank Jesus for that swing. I needed something to go my way there. That's gonna help the confidence. Let's go, Griffey. Now let's do like eight more of those, please. Uh, Gav Main, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Are you a big The Main fan, per chance? The oh, band, The Main? Uh, best band in existence? Ah. <sighs> I thought that was gonna freeze the game. When I was younger, I lived next door to a kid that had the same first and middle name as me, even spelled it the same. Okay, that is wild, Gifford. That's pretty cool, though. Hopefully get some money. You just love Griffey. He's got such a great swing. Well, that's a broken bat out. Come on, Mookie. I'm gonna be 20 in like a month. It feels weird saying I'm gonna be two decades old. Ah, uh, I remember the days when I turned 20. I'm only 22 now, so they, they weren't too long ago. Uh, uh, QAB, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Hope you're doing well, Cam. Welcome on in. How long until Ashley shows up to an 8123 fest? Oh my god, you have no idea. One ball, one Hopefully, strike. sooner rather than later. Dang it! Right, I thought I got my mojo back. Right when I thought. Juice all players in franchise mode to 99 and just go on a grind day one. There we go. Graduated with a kid who is exactly a year older than you. That is really cool. Be 49 in a few weeks. GG's. Congratulations. Happy early birthday. Griffey, four for four, the Grand Slam. Get him some Wendy's, if you will. Yo, let's go Bunk Toozy. Birthday stream. You're going to be dot 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 24. I am 22. Um, Walt, welcome on in. Hope all is well. I'll be turning 23 in December. Dun dun dun. So, in 11 months from now. Well, 10 months and so many days from now. Your birthday is February 25th. Yo, happy early birthday. You're gonna have a White Sox theme party, but your name is Red Sox guy. I'm confused for you. Although I do always appreciate White Sox themed anything, to be honest with you. Yo, let's go Gifford. Happy early birthday. You'll be playing Road to the Show or Franchise Mode on MLB 22. How about both, Matthew? Griffey Machine, we are a big fan of Griffey Jr. on this channel, 100%. Gonna be 40... The big four, oh, Derp Dog. How, what are we doing to celebrate? That's a big birthday for many people. And is the Sand Squad invited? I pre-ordered the MVP edition as I like the physical disc, but this year's cover is so cool, though at least it has the PlayStation 5 upgrade. 100%. Make sure, though, um, Beaver, I don't believe you have a PlayStation 5, or did you just get a PlayStation 5? The upgrade is only possible if you have a disc version of a PlayStation 5. Because what happens is you put the PlayStation 4 disc in the PlayStation 5, and then you download a code that becomes the PlayStation 5 version of the game, but you have to have the PlayStation 4's disc in your console. I don't know why. I think they do it so you don't sell your game. 
but uh that is a thing and just use like the ten dollar code that comes with it you do have the disc version okay that's what i thought we are gucci then you bet they don't make randy endgame randy will come out in stages at least that seems the most uh predictable uh he will come out in stages all right can we have some uh, good at bats here You're all digital on PlayStation 5, but you own the disc. I feel you. I'm, 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 every game I own for the PlayStation 5 specifically is digital. So the only time I use the disc feature is if I'm playing an old PlayStation 4 game, which I haven't really yet. I did log on to the show 20 before I started stream today. I just wanted to compare my ranked season stats from last year to this year. So last year is my first ever year playing ranked. First ever year outside of rookie difficulty, outside of directional hitting, all that fun stuff. I have a much better record this year. So last year, I was 114 to 70 losses. So 114 wins to 70 losses. Right now, I am 76 wins to 24 losses. So a nice little gap right there. You love to see that improvement. But my, my hitting lines are better in the show 20 than they are in the show 21. Like my batting average is like a 20 point difference uh, in favor of my stats in 20 than 21. So I'm wondering if that has to do with that PCI change uh, so many months ago at this point. But uh, hopefully maybe hitting can go back to what it was in the beginning of 21. We'll see. We'll see. Any basketball fans? Many basketball fans. I'm a big Bucks fan myself. Me thinking 25 is old. You're not old until you're like 70. Then you can call yourself old. I forget how old I am. I have to ask what year it is. Maybe yeah. I'll have a White Sox themed party too, since that seems to be all the rage. I highly recommend it. Last year was your first year off rookie. Also, it's a big adjustment. Absolutely, it's a big adjustment. How are we doing, Charlie? Especially when you're going from road to the show rookie directional, where you literally expect to hit every single pitch for a homer. Um, it becomes an adjustment just recognizing balls versus strikes and then which of the strikes you can actually hit. I'm obviously failing at that today. Don't don't let the box score deceive you. My opponent is bad. No offense to my opponent. <laughs> there, there's no reason why this shouldn't this should not have been a mercy or this should have been a mercy around the third inning. I am definitely playing down to my opponent right here. And I don't mean that in a rude way. I, I mean that in, in a critical critical analysis of this game away but that's how it is yo what's up t-rad first game of stream and uh i'm just glad that we're winning it i'm just glad that we are winning it hi there hello i'm angel you're playing down in a br run right now you got this bc epic comeback time i'm either having a super bowl parade party or cry myself to sleep party because the rams lost another Another Super Bowl party. That's right. Your birthday comes up on Wednesday. So that's going to be either a very nice early birthday yeah, present or a not so fun prologue, if you will, into your birthday. We'll see what happens, though. Go Bengals, says Valencia. Today is National Pizza Day. I had no idea. I guess I'll celebrate for dinner. Yeah, my, my university put out an email for pizza day. They're like, come by and get some free pizza. And I was like, no, I gotta get home and stream. Come on, people, get the program. I graduated this year to play not all my conquest games on Hall of Fame. I'm a glutton for punishment. It's only gonna make you better, Dresslin. Only gonna make you better. I believe in you. Ooh, that one's gonna stay in the park. At least it should. Dang, how mad do you think my opponent is right now? That's tough. No, I don't, but I care about being here on time for stream. The Rams should steamroll. In the show 22, I'm only going to be playing rank, so I have an accurate representation of my record and how good I am constructing a team. I actually respect that. But I hope you don't miss out on, like, the events in BR and stuff like that. Felix Hernandez! Oh, you loser! You loser! Wow! Let Felix get the complete game shutout! He only got 26 of the 27 outs. I mean, we all know it was the 20, he was going to get 27 outs. Don't let the hits in the hit column fool you. Don't, don't let them fool you. My opponent just be petty right now. Um, I am going to go in custom practice, though, because I cannot guarantee to win that game against a decent opponent, if you will. Um, so I am going to go ahead into custom practice before we get into this next game, because... 
I'm going to lose that game if I face anyone that's at least average at this game. So, don't mind me as I go in custom practice for just a little bit. That's not what I wanted. So don't mind me, L7 Weenie. GG's though. GG's. We don't let them ruin our mood. I wanted that moment for, for Felix, okay? Oh, I wait. I think I just did load them. I'll load them a second time, I guess. Disrespectful. I've never felt more loved than knowing Ashley likes us more than free pizza. It's quite a- excuse me, it is quite a compliment. It is quite a compliment, y'all. Y'all should know that. Just saying. Just saying. Alright, I'm gonna warm up for like five more minutes. I did do this for like a brief moment before stream. Obviously, I didn't do it as long as I should have. But we are 1-0 on the day. I will never complain nor apologize for a win. Just talking about practice. You know it. You know it. You know it. He did lose, and they did quit to avoid the Felix Hernandez animation at the end. So, uh, we're gonna be a little salty on that, Eddie. But it's okay. We'll get him back into our mood. We'll get back. We'll get back. So, we have be kind, the first two words of every stream title. to always remind us to stay grounded. But, uh, sometimes you get a little triggered by, uh, some of these people who play this game. It is what it is, though. What's custom practice? Never used it. It's where you go. When you need a practice. So let me go with this the four seamer first, then we'll go with the off speed. I know you don't do a T red. Does Ashley love us more than free curly fries? If so, we should free we should feel special. Well, I've never had the opportunity to eat free curly fries. Actually, that's a lie. My friends, um, at the end of our first year of college, they had like all their remaining dining points left. So they, they bought us uh free curly fries using their points, so I, I did have free curly fries, and they were quite delicious. I call that events. I have never played this game or any version of the show, and I'm about to pick up my copy from GameStop. What is the best advice you slash chat can give? Welcome on in, Narcolepse. I hope you are enjoying your day. That's a very loaded question. The biggest thing is this game is overwhelming. It is very, very overwhelming to learn. Take your time. Take your time. If you find a game mode that you enjoy, play the hell out of that game mode, whether it's online, offline, whatever. Um, YouTube could very well be your best friend in case I'm not live and can't answer any questions because I am live. Always feel free to ask me questions, ask chat questions. If you want to jump into our Discord, um, where again, we, we can continue that conversation off stream, I would highly recommend it. In case I can't be there in time to answer a question, we always have uh, members of the community active in that Discord looking to answer some questions, if you will. Um, but hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully you uh, could also get your hands on the show 22 in a couple of months. And uh, yeah. Yo, what's up, Trek? Welcome on in. I tend to like deep franchise modes and I'm familiar with other baseball games, but haven't played since like 2011. I will say this. If you're looking for a deep franchise mode, MLB The Show is not it. MLB The Show really needs to get their franchise mode put together. It is not. Um, if you want to play a deep franchise game mode, um, I would actually not recommend this game. I would recommend Out of the Park Baseball or OOTP um, if you're not familiar. Obviously, if you want to play franchise on this game, you, you can play franchise on this game. But if you're looking for that deep, rich experience, I would recommend OOTP. It is a computer game. It is on your computer and not your console. I would always recommend the show to anyone, but if you're just talking franchise specifics, there's a lot the show can do. Obviously, if you're looking for like surface level, maybe some deep stuff in franchise, yeah, you can pick up the show, but if you really want that deep, enriching experience, it's OOTP. That is OOTP. You do have OOTP? Let's go. So you're more than familiar. You need online franchise? Yes. Yo, what's up, Taco? What are you doing? I'm doing whatever I can to get Randy in 22. Oh, me too. Me too. But of course, I would still recommend picking up the show, Narcolepse. Well, there is so much more you can do, of course. And uh, hopefully, there's a start to revamping franchise mode for all of you who really enjoy the mode. I never really got into it. But I would absolutely love for that to change, um, given a revamped mode. It's going to take some time, though. It's gonna take some time. It's not gonna happen in 22. It might not even happen in 23, or we might see some aspects of it in 23. But we're not gonna see the in-depth mode that we're uh, necessarily used to at the moment. It's paid for, you're literally gonna go pick it up. Yo, let's go, Narc. There we go. 
You play to enjoy the game, but show me. Show me up, then it's on. If you have a stream, I will go into there and talk smack. JH, be kind, my friend. Anyone else hate how the scoreboard is off center from the batter's eye? Dang you, City Field. Yeah, it is not a lot of fun. Yes, franchise order of the show, possibly March to October, and needs revamping next year. Yeah, yeah. It's going to take some time, though. It's not all going to happen in one iteration of the game. If you don't really care about playing the actual games, then OOTP is the way to go. Yeah, that's a good thing about franchise mode in the show, is you can actually play in those games and take control of the individual players, which is very, very nice. An online game mode where 18 players load in, and you can pick your position and play against each other would seem dope. Like a Sandlot mode? I've been saying that, well, I was going to say years. Last year and this year. <laughs> I'm over the show 20. I really wanted it and the show 21. I really wanted it. I'm I'm behind you 100% there CB <sighs> Can I hit this fastball, please? Order the show needs to remove the cap integration. Yes, I very much dislike that about road of the show this year You like OOTP, but you really want to be able to play then the show will help you out in that aspect No, oh, I'm doing very well Gary. How are you doing today? We're just in custom practice mode. I did win our first ranked season game, <laughs> but my approach at the plate was a little messed up. It's a mindset. Don't throw yourself into the deep end too quickly. Find what you're comfortable with and honestly have fun. There are things with Diamond Dynasty especially that get overwhelming and confusing, but overall just have fun. 100%. Uh, Mags World, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. We'll jump into another ranked game in just a moment. I'm gonna start a I'm gonna cl clip on the off-speed stuff. Let's go, click on the off-speed stuff. Are we gonna home run chain and custom practice? Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Enjoy, enjoy when you have a good practice. <laughs> All right, let me just make sure I can also hit the off-speed pitches and the two-seamer, and we'll be good to go. OTP is also available on mobile. You got, getting, got any games on your phone? Got games, games, games. After stream, do you want me to check right now? I can check right now. I'm a multi-tasker. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's not the first time that was said. Five minutes left at work. There we go, JH. Talk more after, Bung. I got you. Are those planes in the game? Well, it is Schrodinger's cats. We hear planes in this game, but we don't see them flying. So, maybe there are. Maybe there aren't. Yes, there are planes in this game. <laughs> the Sandlot mode is an awesome name, too. I mean, that's essentially what it is. When you get nine people, nine players on each side, 18 in total, to queue up. So we'll see. I talked about that a lot in 20. I talked about that a lot in 21. But uh, given all the server issues, we're probably several, several years away from just thinking about that becoming a reality. Yo, hockey with the 99 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Actually, I've been chatting with someone here, but would you want to see some of the steroid era guys into put into the game? They won't just because of the MLBPA. Um, but there are ways around that, i.e. Reggie Stalker. Here for 30 seconds, already so informative. That's what I'm here for. If y'all got questions, I'm always available to answer. Even if I have to swing at an inside pitch outside of the zone. <laughs> Practice doesn't create perfect perfects. Perfect perfects create lineouts. I thought you were going to go with the uh, the Camp Rock 2 song. I see, I see. Hockey with the Hydrate, I got you. How are we doing, Hex? I hope all is well. Is cheesecake a pie? I wonder cheesecake necessarily would be a cake, but it's formed like a pie. Very deep question there, Caleb. I guess it would be a pie, though the name is misleading then. Because isn't it made in a pie tin? I don't know, I'm not, a, I'm not, I don't like cheesecake. But I think when you go to the Cheesecake Factory, it, it, it looks like a pie. It's a pie, dang it. Cheesecake is a brie. <laughs> All right, let's go into another ranked game. I'm gonna get demolished for 10 runs because I'm having a very hard time aligning the PCI for whatever reason today. That's okay, that's okay. Exactly, what kind of cake has a crust? I agree, oh, that's another good way to put it. To, uh, another good way to, to back up your thoughts there. What are words? You've got questions, we've got answers. I have a good chuckle this year and I have to play the Padres. I've flown into San Diego many times so I know what the flight is like and there are some condos behind the right field stands that you've stayed in that is so cool, Coach Long. 
That is very, very cool. I work enough, 100 hours vacation, 40 sick. I get five hours added every two weeks. Ha, J-H, big brain. Get your days off, sir. Get your days off. And with the show, do you like Madden in a draft mode, like franchise mode with your friends, league with your friends? Oh, so you want to see what Madden... I don't play Madden, so if I'm understanding you correctly, you want to see a draft mode where you match up with your friends, you each draft a team, and then you play with your friends? What is that mode called in Madden? I don't play Madden, so this is all new to me. Don't look at the PCI. Watch the ball. You got it. Thank you. You don't like cheesecake? I may need to reevaluate whose stream I watch. Hey, think about it this way, Tar Heel. If I don't eat cheesecake, that's more cheesecake for you. I think that's a good deal. I think that's a good trade-off. Cheesecake would be married to me if it allowed it. If I could marry food, I would marry um, hibachi-style chicken fried rice. 100%. Yo, Kryptonite with the host. I appreciate you. How are we doing today, Crypt? Welcome on in. Online franchise, you think, is what he means? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Cheesecake is way too rich for the human palate. Ooh, is Corbin Burns? Our ace is going to start this one. Let's go. You guys are Red Sox guy. That sounds, like, fun, Nick. Anything with the EA Sports logo on it is do No! Walter Johnson? A P5 Walter Johnson? <sighs> Ten bucks. They're not going to... I'm going to send it. Actually, look at their record. They they quit as much as they win, I would assume. I'm going to send the friendly, though, because I don't want to face Walter Johnson. If they deny it, they deny it. If they deny it, they deny it. Or do we just play this one? We might just play this one. Ten bucks, they deny it, though. Yeah, okay, let's go win. Let's go win. You messed with the wrong person. And they're are 2 -ing. Oh, my God, this game's going to take five hours. Okay, we're gonna lock in and focus. We're gonna lock in and focus. There are two in every single pitch. P5 Walter on the mound. This will be the last game of stream, everybody. You might be thinking to yourself, but Ashley, stream literally just started an hour ago. Yeah, this is the last game, folks. <laughs> T-Red beat me to it. T-Red beat me to it. Nah, get wrecked. We might be toxic today with these games. Hibachi fried rice hits on different levels. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I never mind. I'm not going to say what I was going to say. <laughs> One -oh. I said it as soon as I uh, saw Walter. Well, we did beat Walter in Monday stream. We saw a P2 version of Walter Johnson in Monday stream crushed him. So let's just keep it up today. Keep it up today. We got this survive. Unleash the toxicity. We might be toxic on this Wednesday. I might have to replace be kind with be toxic. <laughs> Go against everything I stand for. <laughs> toxic. Both survive. Although the second one is more fun to say. Toxic. You gotta be toxic. Like the, like the guy from Spongebob. You got chocolate, but toxic. The best hibachi you've ever had is in Orlando. Next time you visit your brother, you'll have to go to Kobe's Steakhouse. Sounds good. I will make note of that. Oh, Leo SpongeBob. We need to get a... We're going to need a fourth inning stretch. Now, the fourth inning is when we're going to walk this game off 10-0. Good job, Griffey. Grab your snacks, chat. This game is going to last at least eight hours. Yeah, we gotta stand up and stretch, everybody. Every half inning. I'm doing really well, Shrek lover. How are you doing today? Fingers crossed the toxic toxicity stops at 4 central, though. It's gotta stop by 7.30 central. At least 7 central, because we gotta prep. If the kids weren't so young, I'd drive the two hours to go there for dinner once a month. I, I respect it. Toxic Wednesday, let's go. That was a grandma and SpongeBob. You are right, Caleb. All right, this is going to demand me to be focused and patient, and I am okay with that. Dang it! That was going to be a 3-0 count, too. Oh. I have a lot of snacks nearby. We Gucci, that's what we like to hear. Almost survive. Let's go, Sharky. Fastball up and in, you're calling it. So far, they can't uh, pitch to me in the zone. Um, play the guy in BR that has played in over 1,400 ranked games. My goodness. I'm not going to swing until I see a strike, even if it's right down the middle. About to make a fajita omelet. Oh my god, can you make me one, please? Well, that's out. Hi, how are you? We'll say hi, how are you? There's a strike. That should have been launched for a homer. Alright, so one strike of six pitches. Ooh, now I'm late on the sinker? What? What? Thank you, Red Sox guy. Appreciate that. 
What kind of snacks do you have nearby? And are you willing to share my truth? Oh, baby. Against P5 Walter Johnson, Apo Taco to start this ball game. My opponent is in for a long one. Let's go. Let's go, survive. You told me. You told me we had this. Not gonna swing until I get a strike. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, you're right. Replay. I got you on the next one, baseball. I got you on the next one. Yo, what's up, Hop? Welcome on in. That's not toxic. I forgot to replay, okay? Don't worry. Oh, we checked it. We checked it. Ah, fuck BS. <gasps> Chat, now you have me hungry for Benihana and pizza. Honestly, me too. I can share my sunflower seeds? Bet. Dang it. Ashley, I thought we were only swinging at strikes today. I quickly broke that promise. Let's go, sports. Michael Nelson Trout. He should have close to a 300 batting average now. Uh, with that swing. You got the MVP edition? Let's go, Packers. Almost heard an F-bomb. Nah, 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 nah. Not that toxic. Not that toxic. I don't know why I'm not pulling that inside pitch. That's usually my sweet zone uh, in this game. We'll get back to it, though. We got you with the replays. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. Ashley never hits another home run in this game. Nah, nah, nah. There's more for that, where that came from. Oh, come on. Okay, it's a base hit. You can't replay a base hit, but just know if you could, I would right there. My cat heard Ashley had to hop up and check it out. Your cat uh, knows good taste of which streams to watch. <laughs> um, Zofer, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Come on, Bryce. Yo, doing pretty well, Zofer. How are you doing today? A man of culture. Oh, that was fair. That's a homer. At least a liner down the line. Dang it. Is Walter, Fons is Walter Johnson not as fun to hit against? No. The windup is very annoying and tedious. Thank you, Red Sox guy. More Panda Express. Enjoy, enjoy. Only a few bad words. <laughs> this is a PG-13 stream. Nah, 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 nah. I, I stand by and appreciate the, the family-friendly tag I put on this stream. I want to make sure... Um, as many people as possible are able to tune into this stream, and I'm gonna keep that going for as long as possible. Till nobody wants to tune into stream. <laughs> You'd rather face Walter than Nolan? I agree. i much rather face uh, Walter Johnson than Nolan Ryan. And I did just see Walter on Monday, so I'm still very familiar with everything that he provides. There's the r 2 It's back, folks. It's back. It's back. I do have three cats. They are the loves of my life. Oh, that was a dot. I don't know how they got a piece of the bat on it. Put it over the baby monitor. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Your stream, I mean, let's go Dresslin. Apparently, Walter Johnson wasn't even that good of a pitcher. According to whatever I read or heard, he was just the best of the dead ball era. Once they entered the live ball era, his stats got much worse. I would believe it. I have to double check that, but that, that, that sounds logical, Tar Heel. New Sabrina song, February 18th. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. That's how I feel about that. Um, but yeah. He's out. Panda Express, where you can try Panda Nuggets? They have Panda Nuggets at Panda Express? Narg, that is not the place here. Um, I don't want to have to ban you, but most people, that would be a ban worthy comment. Um, because you haven't shown otherwise, I'm going to give you another chance. Uh, but that is not the place here, even as a joke. Um, I, I do not accept that here. And you're on the wrong website for that as well, which is a whole nother topic of conversation. All right, come on, Mookie. All right, let's go replay some homers. How about that? Packers of the Hydrate, I got you. Fuzzy said that I love Fuzzy's content. Incredible stuff. No worries, Nark. I, I appreciate you following up with that comment, but just going forward. I, I, I can't give that benefit of the doubt, even though that sounded, to my knowledge, the definition of what that rating means. Well, um, but unfortunately, can't really always give the benefit, of the, the benefit of the doubt like that. However, I appreciate that explanation. We're all good going forward. I got one ball, one Why y'all spamming the hydrates on me? I got you, Sky. I got you. Why can I not hit that baseball? Two 
Come on, Tatis. Tatis' offense has really fallen off for me. One of the best cards for me last year. His defense is what's been keeping him in my starting lineup. And the fact that I, I want to do very good with him offensively. And he's got himself into a full count. We take leadoff walks. We absolutely do. We want to raise that OBP. Oh, I wanted that to be an oppo taco. Very late on that curveball. Yeah. Come on, Tatis. Work in that pitch count. That's what I like to see. Oh, stay fair. Stay fair. <sighs> Sky's up. This game is testing me. This game is testing me. And we strike out on the ball. That, that sounds like how we're playing the game today. Chicago, come on, Ashley. Just one. Just one home run would be really, really nice. I mean, we got one in the first inning. We'll get a couple more. We'll get a couple more. Fancy just secured a second interview with design firm in Chicago. Might be, might be moving back north soon. Let's go, Mo. Best of luck to your fiance. Nice, nice, nice. Disagree about giving the benefit of the doubt to the internet? Then I, I can guarantee you, you, <laughs> you have not been in this position before where you just can't. You, you literally just can't, especially for the safety of the stream environment. I would love to, don't get me wrong, I would love to. Uh, but for safety reasons, it's just not viable on the internet. Just realized today is Tony Stone's birthday, one of three women to play in the Negro Leagues. Happy, happy birthday. Look at Yasmani, he just, he just comes, he just comes into work every day, finding a way to get on base. Corbin Burns with a 261 batting average? Okay, I knew Corbin could rake in this game, I didn't know he could rake that well in this game. Let's see if he can even, like, work a walk, um, if he can. Come on, Corbin. There we go, there we go. That's actually bageling off that curveball. Granted that I could not lay off of it the previous game. At minimum, it's gonna be a five pitch at bat, so we've done our job here. Did our job, even though it's a strikeout, did our job right there. How are we doing, Horns? Welcome on in. Cards in this game do that, I think. I'll be guns a-blazing with them, then all of a sudden for long stretches. Can't hit the broad side of the barn with them. Or how I can be a little worse with, say, the 99 finest Salvi, then the all-star Salvi, it's maddening. I am so good with that all-star game, Trey Turner. And I am poop with the finest Trey Turner. That I'm actually considering swapping the finest for the all-star Trey Turner. I, I very much am. I don't even like cats, but I found a kitten in a storm drain five years ago, and she's been annoying me ever since. So I guess you can say you like them now. He 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 he. Glad that you rescued her, coach. Or did I say coach? Oh, that's because I was reading coaches long. Glad that you rescued her, rescued her Dutch. I was looking at Coach Long's name on the chat right underneath yours. You should play him at shortstop over Tatis. I love how he always prays how good Yasmani is for you, but he still bats eighth. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. With that speed... Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and he's struggling on the hitting side, but sometimes he just comes through in the most unexpected ways. I think that's what I appreciate about him. I keep forgetting to send you a picture of how I used your logo on my custom un uniforms. I'll try and send tonight. Let's go, Sharky! No worries whatsoever about forgetting. Whatever you remember, always feel free to send them. I will be waiting. Nah, I mod for a couple people. I tend to just ban, and I think I've accepted one unban request. Too many problems out there on the internet. Internet, you are not wrong, my friend. Oh, let's go, let's go, Franio with the raid. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome on in. How are we doing, Jr? They call me Wags. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Hello, hello. How are we doing, everybody? How was the stream? I hope you're all doing really, really well. Let's go, JR. Yo, same here, Dresslin. Same here. It's a fantastic card. What's up, Blackout? Welcome on in. I appreciate that shout out, Bunk. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Y'all, click that link. Drop Raniel a follow for me, please. One of the best players in this game. You're always going to see incredible competitive content. 3 0 count for Tommy Edmund, by the way. Oh, 3 0 count. Get over his head. Yes. We're 3 0 swinging. We're 3 0 swinging. I'm doing really well, Wags. How are you doing? Welcome on in. Akura, Akura with the four-month resub. Thank you so much. And welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges. Thank you for the continued support. 
How are we doing? I hope all is well. Hello, hello, Franiel. Welcome on in. I hope all is well. I'm a firm believer that the chat rules pop up and the rules in the about section serve as the first and only warning. You, I would say that is a great way to look at that. Absolutely, Nick. What's up, Polanco? Welcome on in. Thank you, Wags. I appreciate that. Let's go, Bungtuzi. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I die for this little fury, inconsiderate blade demon, to be honest. We all would. We absolutely all would. Oh, I want a trout to go back to back at bats with the home right, right there. JR with the 13 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Did not want to swing there, but I did anyway. And Wags with the 8 bits. Thank you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What's up, Bob? Welcome on in. There we go, Aider. I am doing well, Wags. Glad that you are too. Um, do I steal here with uh, Edmund? It's worth a shot. Yeah, he's safe by a mile. He's safe by a mile. Come on, Tommy. And he's back in. And he's back in. We don't want to get too greedy here. Don't want to get too greedy here. Even though I went 4-0 today and ranked, I think I'm done for the day. The game is tiring. Yo, GG's, Charlie. Charlie, and yeah, you're not wrong. This game is tiring. This game is tiring. I know, I decided to switch it up on you, Sunday. If you if you prefer Sunday, I got you. If you prefer Bob, I got you. If you prefer 21, I got you. He's safe, he's safe. Come on, Tommy. What's the Super Bowl sound your stadium plays? Oh, so in bass sound, you're saying. You know where my brain is at this upcoming Sunday. Um, I'm not sure. I don't believe I have a sound equipped. If there is, it's whatever the default sound is. I'm laughing. Good, 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 good. I'm glad there's some comedy at least. <laughs> Everybody's safe. Everybody's safe. Stolen base, Ashley. Come on, man. I'm trying over here, Tar Heel. I'm trying. I had an exam this morning and a presentation, which I nailed both of those, by the way. <laughs> but my brain is just a little fried, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> That's a tough out with the 2-0 counts. On paper, I think the Cleveland Guardians, my favorite team, have, have as good of a starting rotation as any team in the majors. Let's go, Gary. And if they can stay healthy for the most of the season, at least, I think they could win about 94 games or so and win the AL Central, as long as they have a slightly above average offensive season. I like that perspective. I do agree that the Guardians have a very competitive um, starting rotation, but... I don't know if they're going to have an above average offense. They, they, that's definitely an area where they struggle. Hopefully the pitching can keep them alive, as you say. I personally, and it could just be my White Sox bias, I want the White Sox to win the AL Central. Um, I do think the offense is their weakness. If they can address it, I think they'll have some competition in the AL Central. If they can't, then they're going to have a lot of, a lot of Jacob DeGroms, if you will. Giving up only one or two runs a game, but taking the L because the offense just can't even score one. Presentations gave you anxiety. You're not alone in that feeling. I, I'm i the opposite. <laughs> I thrive in a presentation um, setting because all the attention is on me. And most of you are probably like, oh no, all the attention is on me. But I'm over here like, hi everyone. Allow me to capture your attention. I guess if anything is when I say all the attention on me, that's not always the case. Besides your professor, everyone is just thinking about themselves if they're not on their laptop or their phone. At least when I'm listening to presentations, I mean, I'll, I'll try my best, of course, to listen all throughout. That's not always the case. I'll be like, ooh, what's for dinner? And then I'll be thinking about dinner as I'm looking at you presenting your presentation. If that helps bring a sense of calmness next time you present, is you might think all the attention is on you when in reality you're not really receiving that much attention, but it's definitely out of your element. So there's definitely a fear factor there. You're Yo, GG, Sunday. You're in the middle of a six-page research paper on ethics and business communications, whatever that means. Have you seen Billy Madison, Tar Heel? Business ethics. I think that's exactly what that means. Dang. That's not what we wanted to give up. <laughs> you caught me. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh yeah, UNC. And, and he's a Guardians fan, so if he if you he, if he's um what's the word I'm looking for? If he's criticizing his team, you know he's doing it because he loves the team and he knows where the exploits are. Mad respect there. 
That's why I always used to present first. After that, you can just chill. Oh yeah, there's definitely that into it. I feel as a streamer, you have to be a bit of an extrovert, right? I would agree. Um, I do think streaming in a way, um, it depends, it depends, it depends. Being an extrovert will help you, in my opinion, no doubt, but it's 100% possible as an introvert. Because obviously, you know, you're in the comfort of your own um, area, whether that's at your house, whether you have a studio. What are these hits? It's going to be a tied ball game. All on two outs, all these hits. All right, he should be out at second. JK, because everybody is fielding no, so slow. Thing. Wow, that's an RBI double right there. That hits? Very late. How is that not even a foul ball? Um, what are we talking about? Oh, yes, 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 yes. There is that comfort, but of course. Um, especially if you have, like, viewer count on and you can wrap your head around how many people might be watching you, there's definitely a sense of anxiety and pressure just from those numbers. Um, however, I don't think it should deter you from streaming, uh, regardless and if you're um, an ambivert, an extrovert, or an introvert. But there's definitely, like, a comfort factor in streaming when you're, when you're in your own space. I hate this game so much. There is no reason this opponent should be beating me right now. No reason whatsoever. We're going to put on a show in the bottom of the fourth. Yo, what's up, DM Neos? I'm doing really well. How are you? Just losing to a bad opponent, you know? I think a hard part would be the feeling like you're talking to yourself the whole time. There, there can definitely be that uh, factor. Okay, maybe I should stop spamming the sinker. <laughs> that could probably be my issue right now. Ambivert? Yes, it's, it's a mix of both. If you don't believe that's a word, look it up. Look it up. Aye. That's a dot, at least. All right, let's stop showing the sinker. I think that's gonna, that's Aye. that's my downfall right now. I've been spamming the sinker and that's why we're down two runs. There we go. Don't throw the sinker, Ashley. Yo, Emrys with the raid. Thank you, Emrys. How are we doing today? What's up, Peach? Welcome on in. If y'all could click that link that T-Rat put in chat for me and give Emrys a follow, I would really appreciate that. What's up, Emrys? Which is why, which as I've complimented you before, you have a conversation with us, with us almost the whole time, and that's what makes me so happy I discovered you. I appreciate that so much, Ray. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are we doing, Emrys? How's the game going? I hope all is well. Good, good, relaxing at the moment. Hopefully SDS rewards you for these bullish hits. Yeah, yeah. All right, please bloop for a hit. No, I thought it was gonna be straight to center field. Yeah, I'm convinced the CPU feels bad for opponents who can't hit well and for one random inning it rewards all the bad swings. I'm convinced about the same thing. I believe you just hadn't heard of it before, so didn't know if that was what I should have Googled or if I misheard. Gotcha, I see, I see, but yes. It was a phrase that I became aware of not too long ago. I think sometime in my college career. Two balls, but it no does point. exist. Emrys with the nine month resub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Peach with the follow. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Emrys, welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges. And thank you so much for the continued support. And thank you once again for the raid. I, I really, really appreciate that. I almost accidentally stopped stream. I almost clicked the wrong button on my stream deck. Thank you so much, Emrys. I appreciate you. I'm an engineer. I don't English. Two balls, two strikes. All right, let's go, Cody B. That can definitely help a lot of people bunk. Absolutely. I personally keep mine on. We got three um, but if you're ever struggling, that is a very, very quick way to hopefully uh, find a solution to your struggles. One out walk. We take it. We take it. Come on, Yasmani. M3 with the five gifted subs. Thank you so much, M3. Let's have a good at bat here with the Osmani for you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Subpar, DM Neos, Era, Polanco, and Jet. Let me see all the thank yous in chat heading toward M3's way as I welcome you all into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges, but I need to start seeing some thank yous. Thank you so much, M3. I really appreciate that. We're going to warm up the bullpen here. Hopefully have some one-out damage. I didn't really want to swing there, but I was too committed. So we swung anyway. Not trying to steal, steal here, my friend. Today is a good day for the Sand Squad. Always a good day for the Sand Squad. 
That's a good pitch. I personally enjoy the viewer count. It serves as a bit of an instant gratification. There's at least one person enjoying what I say. I feel similarly. Absolutely. Gotcha, Gary. Come on, Corbin. I need you to be a pitcher who rakes right now, and I know you're more than capable of doing so. If not, we'll lead off the next inning with our leadoff guy, so that's not a bad thing either. But I gotta get some uh, work going with the bottom of the lineup. Oh my god, bloop in front of the right fielder. Oh, I was hoping to get a bad animation. The one time in the game you want a bad animation. When, it, when it's your opponent. Yo, what's up, Captain Tater Tot? It is going pretty well. How are you doing? We're 1-0 in ranked seasons to start today. We're facing a P5 Walter Johnson. So that's been a lot of fun. I have not been playing... Is it frozen? Oh, there we go. I have not been playing very well today. We... We were, able, we were able to pitch a shutout in the previous game, so we were able to win that one. Uh, this game, I decided to spam the sinker for whatever reason, and it led me to my downfall in the previous inning. But uh, we'll get back on offense, I hope. At least the pitching's doing well for us. Hitting's got to step up to the plate. See what I did there? See, see what I did there? Hitting's got to step up to the plate. I'll see myself out. I'll, I'll see myself out right right here right now. All right, gotta head out have an in interview to prep and do have a great stream I appreciate you. I appreciate you Emrys. Go rock this interview. I believe in you. Good luck my friend. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you Yo, what's up easy? How are you doing today? I'm doing just the same old same old for you today Kind of just vibing and lurking respect respect Glad to hear that everything's going well though. Always nice to hear that. Ah, dang it trouty Speaking of pitchers who wake, who rake, have you heard of Michael Lorenzen? Oh, you know I have. He was a reliever for the Reds, but also was good at hitting. Uh, he just signed a one-year deal with the Angels and looks like he has some big two-way player potential. Okay, okay. But he is in the American League with the Angels, so he might not have an opportunity to use that potential. Especially when they all got a, a nice little person called Shohei Otani already on that squad. Darn you, I was looking at the snow when you asked, is it frozen? And now I'm singing, do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Okay, bye. I'm doing well, easy. Thank you for asking. Glad you are too. All right. That's a big out. I, I That's what I figured, Mason. That's why I, I corrected it as I said it. Have a great evening. Tip your weight staff. I'll see myself out. Thank you so much for hanging out, Big Dale. I appreciate you. Have a fantastic rest of your week, and hopefully, I will catch you for Friday's stream. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh, we are dotting the plate. I need to get my offense going. I'm not going to let that fourth inning define us as pitchers, because uh, we're doing pretty well right now. That's a good point, NCAA. How are we doing today? Hope all is well. Lorenzen was one of the guys who went short sleeved in the best jerseys. Dude is ripped. That's right. I just remember Derek Dietrich in them. He is jacked. Nintendo Direct hype? Was that, that was today, right? I, I believe it started right when stream started. So uh, I will be watching it after stream. I also need to watch uh, Ben's podcast uh, about the show with Ramon on as a, as a guest. I did not have a t uh, enough time to listen to it this morning before or after school. So uh, I will do that after stream. We got a lock in. We got a lock in here. Bottom of the fifth. This going to be a turning point for us. At the hitting uh, side of things. 5 p.m. I was thinking it was 1 p.m. What pod was that? I don't know. Some some podcast you, you might have heard. It's like flipping bats. I don't know who flips bats. Like, come on. Put your head down and run around the bases. Could you imagine if that's how I thought? Oof. Why are we doing Spore? Never heard of it. Yeah, me neither. It was, it was like suggested this morning. I was like, huh? Are you speaking English? Come on, Tommy. Gotta annihilate that pitch. I am off of the plate very poorly right now. Oops. <laughs> LOL, imagine being that person. Luckily, I don't have to. Listen to Ben's show this morning. Some awesome info for everyone's favorite SDS employee. Big Ramon fan. How can you not be? I love Ben so much and Ramon for that matter. Exactly. I'm very much looking forward to it. So no spoilers in chat. Although I saw a couple of his tweets. But I would you call those spoilers? Y'all, that's how my day is going. I'm swinging at that curveball. That would have been a homer for your opponent. That's what I'm saying, M3. I'm not, I'm not doing myself any favors. 
P5 Walter Johnson. Oh my god. Did Ramon reveal where the diamonds are? Where are the diamonds, Ramon? Best bat flipping was Wilson Contreras, unfortunately against the Sox in 2020 at the rate. Now, don't get me wrong, that was a fantastic a bat flip. But is it the best bat flip of all time? We need to make a bracket. We need to make a bracket of the best bat flips in each season, respectively. Obviously, we're seeing more and more of them as the seasons progress. But I, I need a bracket of bat flips. I guess we would have to make it virtual, of course, so we can like include little videos just to remind people. But that was a dope bat flip, even even if it was against my White Sox. But you gotta respect the craft of a good bat flip. How I got a homer in that pitch. Jose Batista, 15 versus Texas. Oh yeah, in the postseason. I'm over over moving the PCI here. Yo, good afternoon, Poggers. How are you doing today? Hope all is well. We're just trying to stay alive and get some base runners. If Griffey walks, I hope he does. We need to do something here, though. Tatis' bat flip is pretty sick. Oh, yeah. And Tim Anderson's bat spike. Oh, come on! Get out of here! And yes, they're replaying because it's P5 Walter Johnson. And I'm sick and tired of P5 Walter Johnson. Let's go. It's a one-run ball game. Uh, the bad NFL hires this cycle. Well, the Packers uh, special teams coach is a good one, though, but that is a question we can definitely talk about. PR idea for SDS. Ramon walks around in the U.S. with a briefcase full of the diamond cards handcuffed to his wrist, and the players do an Ocean's Eleven-style heist for their diamonds. Or like a Brooklyn Nine-Nine heist. Halloween heist. Yo, what's up, Sportmaster? Welcome on in. It's super subtle, but I think my favorite bat flip of all time is Kyle Schwarber's against... Um, Garrett Cole and the Pirates in the 15 wild card game. I do not recall that bat flip, but I will make sure to look that up uh, after stream because I'm very intrigued. Nice PCI. <laughs> it was better than my opponents, I will say that. All right, come on, Mookie. I, how did we follow that off? That's got to be a strikeout. That, that's got to be a strikeout. But hopefully we can tie this game up now. That's what I would like. Jorge Soler's little bat flip when he hit the ball out of out of the earth in Houston. That was that was quite a bat flip, I would agree. We might be competent on special teams next year. We might just be average on special teams right here. It's gonna be incredible, Josh. Okay, that's a good changeup. Tatis Jr. for sure. Duh, that's what I'm saying, perfect theory. I, I do enjoy a very good Tatis bat flip. Exactly, M3. We need cards for position players who pitch. Yes, bring in Lieri Garcia. Absolutely. The DD Gregorius bat drop against the Twins in the playoffs. That I do recall. All right, Corbin. Need to have a nice shutdown oh, inning right here against the heart of the order. Gotta win this game. I mean, I understand there's a race problem that NFL head coach and hires, but that doesn't explain Lovey Smith over uh, Biennemi, I believe. Is that how you pronounce it? Bo uh, Bowles, uh, McDaniels over Harbaugh, or McDaniel over Lef Left Witch and Frazier. Harbaugh, I believe, just didn't want to come back. I, I know he expressed interest. I, I did not see the conclusion of that, however, besides he wasn't going to be in the NFL. Best no doubt animation this game? Ooh. You might call me a homer. I do enjoy Osmani Grandal's no doubt home run. I love Ken Griffey Jr.'s. You like Jr.'s the most? We're on the same page. If it wasn't for the dome in Toronto, Batista's bat would have ended up in Lake Ontario. Oh, 100%. No doubt about it. No doubt, no doubt. Oh, Even below average may get the pack to the Super Bowl. Just can't get away with non-existent. Oh yeah, you cannot have 10 guys on the field for the game-winning field goal. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Babe Ruth stutter step is fun. The G-Man Choi bat flip against the Twins. DD Gregorius no doubt animation was ama is amazing. I remember I really liked his MLB The Show 20 no doubt animation. That was really cool. All right. Bottom of the six. Gotta at least tie this one up. Ball, that's in. Leslie Frazier definitely needs another shot at head coach. I would agree. Reggie Jackson and Ricky Hendersons are pretty disrespectful, and I'm here for it. You and me both. I understand why you might want a defensive guy in Houston, but there were better candidates like Dan Quinn, Todd, Leslie. Not a guy who was terrible in Tampa. Ashley, it would help if you can swing at a pitch that's right down the middle. 
All right, come on, Bryce. We got a lot getting focused up here. Scott Pesednik's bat flip. Oh, Scotty Pods. Can we get Scotty Pods in this game? Oh my God, Bryce. Beat it out, beat it out, beat it out. Nope. No, he's down. Oh, I thought he had a chance. I thought he had a chance when that wasn't caught. Dang it. We get a Tatis bat flip after a no doubt home run. I missed a couple comments. A couple chat. Speaking of horrible NFL hires, Jags decided to go with Doug Peterson for their head coach. I thought that was a little puzzling. Uh, day close, 100%. What if we got Joe Buck as the new play-by-play -play announcer for the show 22, and there's no option to turn it off? I mean, I always turn off commentators no matter who they are, just so I can focus on the game. I personally don't mind Joe Buck. I know I know many, many people do mind him. I personally don't. I'm not I'm actually not a big fan of Troy Aikman. If you're talking about the duo of Buck and Troy, at least for football, obviously, because Troy obviously only does football, Buck does both. Uh, I'm not a big fan of Troy Aikman. But this time you can't turn him off. I'll just keep my earbuds out. I just won't hear the game. <laughs> well, Come on, Cody B. I have no idea where my runner is. It didn't show my, my base running map. It didn't show, are you kidding me? I was spamming circle and it, what? I gave up an out because the game decided not to show me where my base runner was and allow me to tell them to go back to first? That can't not happen. I don't care what month it is. I don't care which game mode you're playing, especially ranked seasons. That's a free out. Ridiculous. I hate to rage, but this game deserves it a lot of the time. There's no excuse for that. Especially when I didn't see that, that I when I knew that we lost that I was literally pointing my analog stick to where I thought Tatis was which was on second base and I was spamming circle dude wasn't even moving He had his hands on his hips and he was just chilling there as he got picked off for the double play or forced out for the double play D5 with the hydrate Renegades I don't know. It's just that, that can't happen. And the thing that's frustrating me the most is this player's not good. I'm just being terrible right now. And and giving a f giving up a free out is is not a benefit to myself at all. Uh, New Jersey, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. But it's epic comeback time. So all all's well that ends well. We're gonna be all right. Yo, Papa Vaz with the raid. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How was the stream? Welcome on in Taco. Welcome on in Dan and Shree Boy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you being here. How was the stream, Bunk? Thank you for the shout out. If y'all could click that link and drop Papa Vaz a follow, I would really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And Taco with a 21 month resub, Taco. Thank you so much and welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges and thank you so much for the continued support. Thank you so much, Taco. 21. Hey, Taco, what's 9 plus 10? 21? It was great enjoying all the great news today. That's what we love to hear. Oh, Yasmani overswung there. Overswung. We got to tie the game up with that pitch. How are we doing, CJ? Welcome on in. Yo, what's up, Dad Bods? It's going really well. How are you? Thank you for asking. We're playing a little bit of a frustrating game. I'm not gonna lie to you all. It's been a it's been a very frustrating. But it's a one-run ball game, as Yo just pointed out. It's a one-run ball game. We're gonna be okay in the end. Just gotta stick to our game plan here. Always a pleasure. I appreciate you, Taco. Thank you so much. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Now we roll it back up to the top of the order. Let's go. Matt Kemp, one of the best right-handed swings in this game. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. 21. Let's go, Bunk. How we doing, Giggities? Hope all is well. Am I Ashley Cylinders today? It's very possible. We won the first ranked game. This is our second ranked game. We'll see what happens, though. Oh, Tommy. 
We swung before that pitch was out of his hand. Get down the line and stay fair. Well, if that would have stayed fair, that would have been a double play. So maybe it's a good thing it didn't. There we go, Tommy. Hey, we just need some base runners. Oh, not you, Siri. We need some base runners. Hey, full count, full count. Come on, Tommy. I want to see Mike Trout. I want to see Mike Trout with two runners on. Stayed alive. Stayed alive. Let's go. Let's go. We got to focus in. Come on now, Tommy. I believe in you. Not trying to steal any bases. Not trying to steal any bases. If I didn't see it, it never happened. You can just go back in the five, Dan. Siri stream. Let's go, Nick. Oh my god, that emote is great. Dancing frog? That looks like a cat. Dang it, Tommy. Out. Out. They double clutched the baseball and still got the double playoff? How do you throw out Tommy Edmond when, when you hesitate like that? That's a little puzzling. That's a little puzzling, not gonna lie. Tommy too slow? He shouldn't be. This game, I don't know what this is. It's why the Expos never won a championship in chat franchise. Dan is sleeping by the time the final game comes. Dang it, Dan. Unhitch the trailer. How about that actual trailer that we saw this morning? Randy Johnson and Ryan Howard. I cannot even fully comprehend my excitement alone for those two cards and how they're going to be. Yo, what's up, Tato? Welcome, welcome. Did you see the trailer this morning? Uh, the first gameplay trailer of the show 22? Chef's Kiss. It's a masterpiece. Very, very enjoyable. Oh, that's Alrighty. Hey, the attendance isn't zero. We have dinosaurs here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't forget about our dinos. I did. I'm so hyped. Let's go. Randy Johnson better not get the Pedro treatment. Better be maxed out pitching wise. I would agree 100% with that. Absolutely. Ooh, that was actually a nasty slurve. Very well done, Aaron. You have no idea how badly I want to win this game. A P5 Walter Johnson and an r 2 -er. Y'all have no idea how badly I want to come back here and win, so I'm just gonna do it. Thank you, Red Sox guy. It's Ashley that's never awake. That's because I have school tomorrow. I have to be asleep at an, at an appropriate time. I have school all week. Yo, what's up, stinky thumbs? Stuff like that's why I don't play this game anymore. And unfortunately, I don't have much faith in SDS making 22 much better. It's going to be a work in progress for the next couple iterations, to be honest. Hopefully, at least we see those positive strides. But I don't fault you for that opinion at all. Not at all. Are your dinosaurs animatronic or are they clones using Sue's DNA that you stole from the Field Museum? Um, it could be a combination of both. And a third option, I went back in time, snagged a couple dinos. Sleep? What is that? I have school tomorrow too, says Dan. And you're in the East Coast. So, I mean, I'm surprised you're even awake at the start of uh, Chat Franchise. Out number two. But I respect the grind, Dan. I, I respect the hustle. Sleep? What is that? I don't know. It's something you're supposed to get, but we never do. 10 p.m. isn't late anymore. It really isn't. Until it's a Friday and you're just tired, so then you're in bed at 9, and then you're asleep by 9.30. Yes, that has happened to me several times, and that's okay. What school, says Zach? It is this place where you get edumacated. Win the game, you got it, Jacob. How are we doing, Strub? You went back in time and you didn't bring Minnie Minoso to appear on stream? I mean, there, there are rules and regulations. I mean, that's why Minnie's in the game. Because of me. Because of the hard work I did to bring it back. And that's why the dinosaurs are in the Jurassic bubble. Come on, Mason. Get with the program. Oh, that's why I'm dumb. <laughs> Zach. <laughs> Sleeping before Saturday on Friday? Never happened before. Not most Fridays I'm up late. But sometimes you just need that Friday where you're in bed by 9, 9.30 and you just watch TV and then you fall asleep. What is this sleep in this school? I haven't heard of either. Oh, no. Edumacation, exactly. School is a scam. Just use Google. Oh, no, Strub. I, I have several questions for you. Late at 9.15 p.m.? 9.15 p.m. is subjectively late. Depends who you ask. Off the plate, ball one. With that being said, hold on. Two balls, no strikes.
was just my mom. Back to the regularly scheduled stream. Oh, come on, Trout. Okay, 3-0 count. Are we swinging? I think they have to throw us a strike here first. Only because my PCI has been off a little bit. Though we could probably have home run on that pitch. Quick chat. Learn lip reading. <laughs> it was mostly just me nodding along. I wish I knew how to read lips. That... I mean, he's incredible for many, many reasons, don't get me wrong, but Jason Benetti is incredible for another reason. He can oh. read lips, and he'll read lips when there's, like, arguments and altercations on the baseball diamond, and I'm like, ah, yes, Jason, another reason why you are the best of the best. Can we talk about that swing right there for a moment? Can we talk about that real quick? Those are some interesting facial expressions. I'm a very animated person, okay? <laughs> It's hard to contain the expressions. No balls, two strikes. Come on! No! Oh, I needed that! I needed that! It's okay. It's okay. You can read lips if it's dictated well, if there's good diction. Ashley, get your head in the game! How am I late on that pitch? <sighs> a thing of beauty. I love those bad lip reading NFL videos on YouTube. Those are dang, so dang funny. I agree. I am. I don't know what's going on with me at the plate. I, I'm not just missing my swings, but I'm missing them a lot. By a lot, I should say. Ball, that's in. I, I don't lose these games. We still have a half inning to work with. I, well, full inning because we have to pitch this one, of course. We're gonna be okay, but I'm I'm a little concerned with uh, some of the swings I'm having. Can I ask why you always reposition your PCI before each swing? Um, I'm guessing location. And I, I also know where my comfort zone is in the PCI, and if depending on where I have it in the zone, um, how confident I feel adjusting that to adjusting that to different parts of the zone. That's where my comfort is. But right now, because I'm losing, I'm trying to move my PCI a little bit too much and a little bit too quickly. And that's why we're getting a lot of these poor swings on my end. Nope. Yo, what's up, Governor Goose? Hopefully you had a very nice day at school today. I had two classes this morning. They went well. Hopefully yours did too. Do I attend sporting events at my school? I do. I do, I do, I do. They are quite enjoyable, if I do say so myself. Although I missed bingo night last night. We had a bingo night last night, and I was taking an exam for my genetics class. It's, it's a night class. It was the only time genetics was offered, and obviously it's a major requirement. So I had to take it, of course, which I'm fine with. I enjoy it. But uh, I had an exam during bingo night last night, and I'm... Very upset I missed bingo. Y'all don't understand. I really enjoy bingo. I won. I won the whole bingo last semester when, when we had bingo night. They do like a grand finale prize. And I won it last semester. And I didn't have a chance to redeem myself. Or not redeem myself. I didn't have a chance to, de to defend my reigning title. And I'm a little salty about that. Not gonna lie. I got to know what got you into baseball. My mom. My mom is a huge baseball fan. Bingo skills. What's up, Boca Woka? What kind of sports do they offer at the University of Nunia Business? Oh, well, you know, sports and some more sports. They had a Mardi Gras thing in my uni today, and by the time I got out of class, they ran out of food. Rip. No. That's so sad. That's the worst when they run out of food and you miss it. Is the grand prize a dog named Bingo? Yes. Yes. Absolutely. I just lol when asked, uh, Doug Peterson says if given a chance he would hire Matt Nagy as a coach and his staff in Jacksonville. When will they learn that offense, that bad offense does not win games? It's a question you have to ask. Uh, they have casino bingo up at, uh, Potawatomi in Milwaukee. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Um, I'm gonna go to that from time to time. It's fun. Huge prizes. Well, what kind of prizes? Do I need to make a little road trip up north a little bit from the Chicagoland area? I'll do it. I'll do anything for bingo. Exactly, birds. Smart university. <laughs> but this this has skills, unlike the skill of pulling that lever in slots. Ooh, Lee Smith is coming to the game. I typically do well against him. Hopefully, I don't bite myself, bite my tongue um, after this game. Counts one Patience. Eight. Let's go. Let's focus up here. I need y'all. I need y'all. Let's go. 
Let's go, let's go. Come on, Bryce. No, 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 no. Good slider. I got the count. One and two. That was such a late swing. I did not want to swing at that pitch. I'm down bad right now with the plate. I'm down really bad. Ball. All right, come on, Tatis. Let's have a little bit of a better at bat than Harper did. That's it! Let's go! Stay fair! Stay fair! Stay fair! Stay fair! Tied ball game. Let's go! Let's freaking go! Now it's walk-off season! Now it's walk-off season! I need to breathe. I had to replay that just so I could breathe right there. Let's go! Let's go. Come on, Cody B. You're due. You're due. Inside, ball one. Come on. Let's go, Victor. Let's go, local. Let's go, Boca Loca. Let's yeah. go, Bland. There we go, Jake and Tato. Jake Ub, excuse me. Dang it, that's a bad one swing. Ball. Good fork Two ball, strikes. though. Staying alive. Staying alive. Come on, Cody B. Come on, Cody B. Ball, that's Hands up. are sweaty now. Full count. We just need a base runner. Let's get the winning run on base. Get the winning get run on base. base. Let's go. Come on, Yasmani. Come on, Yaz. Let's go, Mason. How are your knees and arms? <laughs> They're weak. Steve C checked me and brought into the game. Okay. Gotta watch out for that funky release. Funky release. And uh, because the three batter minimum rule, as long as Yasmani does not ground into a double play, uh, Shohei Otani is going to be our pinch hitter. Come on, Yaz. Dang it. Good change. Good change. Come on. Get out. Get out. Let's go! Yasmani Grandal with the walk-off! Are you bleeping me? We don't lose those! We do not lose those! Come on, get hyped! Get hyped! Come on, Yasmani! I don't lose those! I don't lose those! Finally had some decent at-bats right there! Let's go! Let's go! My hitting has been horrific for whatever reason today. And we squeeze out two major W's. Major W's when, I, when I'm having a hard time uh, keeping the ball in fair play. Big 2-0 start to today's stream. Oh my goodness, Joe and Tar Heel. Tar Heel with the 1,000 bits. That's how it's done. Thank you, Tar Heel, so very much. Emotes and chat to you and for you. And Joe with the 21 month resub with the Twitch Prime. Yes, Joe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. I hope you continue to enjoy those emotes and sub badges. And thank you so much for 21 freaking months, Joe. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tatis down one run with two with one out in the bottom of the ninth. Tatis hits the solo to tie it. And then Yasmani Grandal, after a Cody Bellinger walk, hits a two-run bomb to win it. I'm out of breath. <laughs> I'm out of breath. That was that was exciting. That was exciting. Uh, I guess you can say that's friendly quit karma. I, I saw the P5 Walter Johnson, and, and I was like, nope. So I sent the friendly quit at the beginning of this game. I'm glad they said no. I'm, I'm glad they said no. And Tar Heel is gifting a sub to DeGrooch. Tar Heel, thank you so much. DeGrooch, welcome on into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges. I hope you thank Tar Heel. Tar Heel, thank you, thank you, thank you. Emotes and chat for you. Thank you um, for updating the, the rating there, T-Rad. I appreciate that. I don't know if I can play another ranks game, though. We might have to go to BR. 
but uh how can you not be hyped after that you know what i'm saying yo nugs with the 100 bits thank you so much nugs that kicks off a hype train level two at four percent thank you so much i hope all is well oh my goodness i'm actually gonna back out of here real quick just take a quick breather quick, quick five minutes quick five minutes here your cable box gives you more issues than the Orioles? Uh-oh. I did my hawk impression out loud and Mookie and her heating pad fell off the cat apartment. Oh no, I hope she's okay. Six speed on a walk around the bases must take forever. It is very joyous though. I appreciate you, Tario. Yeah, to start a hype train, it has to be like three different actions than from all the same person, but I really appreciate that, Tario. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All I gotta say to that opponent is get quacked. <laughs> All right, um, what do you all want to see now? Do you want to see another ranked game or do you want to see some BR? I believe I'm 680, so we can start matching up in Hall of Fame. Um, I don't really want to play a Hall of Fame game without having warmed up to Hall of Fame, so I might come back to this on Saturday. I agree. I think we're going to do some BR. We were, we were down at the plate. Two wins today. Two and oh. Two and oh. We are three and oh on Monday. Two and oh today. That's a nice five oh right now in the week. On Saturday, we'll come back to rank seasons. Um, hopefully by Saturday, we can get close to the 800s and then a World Series push the following week if possible. But we will play some BR for the last hour or so of, of today's stream. There is a new program. So we'll, we'll have a chance to keep track of points once more. So let me just update the title. I really appreciate all uh, sticking with me and watching that and uh, cheering for that epic comeback victory. I mean, the comeback queen emote exists for a reason. Tatis ties it and Yasmani walked it off. That was pretty, pretty exciting. Let me just uh, edit the, the BR command real quick. And uh, we will get ourselves into a draft she's fine fell only six inches onto the windowsill but it was funny af you know ashley i didn't come for a lecture i came for a hype train i appreciate you tar Heel. sounds good day thank you for hanging out in between your break hopefully have a good rest of your day at school let's go jay how are we doing emilio how are the both of you doing today i hope all is well Ooh, wade boggs and salvi you know we gotta go salvi here you know we gotta go salvi that was exciting. I'm very happy. I I am still out of breath, but I am very, very happy with that. New BR program? Sweet. Let's get it, Luke. Obviously, no new rewards. No new rewards. But there is, of course, the new program. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa, whoa wait. Whoa, 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 wait. Tyler Naquin? I'm seven for nine with? Oh, oh, come on, Tyler. Welcome back to the Chicago Bubblegum. Okay, I see you, I see you. Game just froze? No, Z. I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully, your opponent quits out and you get the dub. I know that's not always the case, even if you're the one who's winning. Um, I don't really know where to go here. I guess we'll go starting pitcher. That makes sense. But how's everybody doing today? I hope your Wednesdays are going well. It's the middle of the week. If the first half of your week didn't go great, I hope the second half kind of turns it around for you. Um, this Friday, we'll be having friendlies on stream. So if you want to play against me, you'll have an opportunity on Friday. And then for Saturday's stream, we'll play some ranked seasons. And then, of course, today, we're going to end today with a BR run after starting 2-0 in ranked. Got to go Jack Peterson here, I feel. Or J-Rod. What do you all think? J-Rod or Jock? I kind of want to go J-Rod. Yo, what's up, Shelly? Welcome on in. Hope all is well. There's Predators on tonight, so you're a happy camper. Nice. The Bunks just had back-to-back -back games. So uh, they're off tonight, but they were quite good. Did I just say the Bunks? I did. I said the Bucks, but I guess I could make it a pun with the Bunks. Jock, I agree. I agree. Grizzly wanted J-Rod. If he pops up uh, in the next draft, we can definitely uh, consider him. Um, have I not used any of these cards? Geraldo at least is... Geraldo could be our leadoff hitter with the contact and the speed. I wouldn't mind that, though Michael is the more all-around. Um, hitter, he is a lefty, but I... Yeah, we're gonna go with Michael here. And we got that level one hype train completed. Thank you all so very, very much. Let's go uh, finish out this pretty decent draft so far, if I do say so myself. 
and uh get a couple of uh wins strung together jay thank you so much for the follow jay welcome to the sand squad hopefully you are enjoying your day yeah we can go mike stanton here before he was john carlos stanton jose alvarado that's in fine uh, yeah we'll go xander bogarts here grizzy thank you for the follow welcome to sand squad not gonna lie, I think you already were followed before. No worries at all. Mike Stanton before the name change. Um, I guess we, we'll go first baseman here. We're gonna need a new first baseman to hopefully pop up. Ooh, gotta go Zach. Gotta go Zach. We have our three lefties. Now we're gonna go in the bullpen. Um, Ryan Howard, or Ryan Howard. I'm already thinking about the show 22 for first baseman. Ryan Zimmerman, excuse me, um, would be our replacement at first base and i think we are going to take ryan if not he can stay on the bench if we find somebody better to put up at first base now we have four lefties all right we're good with lefties in the bullpen now now we can kind of stack um to righties we'll have our versatility and munoz right here ryan howard he's coming and i'm so excited i am so excited all right here's our speedster for a pinch runner ah uh, here's the diamond okay Joey Votto is three for seven. Christian Arroyo is six for 15. Austin Riley is 0 for five. Okay, Austin Riley is not an option right here. So what do we have? Um, we do have Ryan Zimmerman. Ooh, I think we go Christian here. I think we go Christian at the very least play him at first base. Yeah. I think I am going to go Christian over Joey Votto, especially because he, he's had more success over a longer period of time. That's Chad Johnson to Chad Ochocinco. Hey, it's quite a name, though. It's quite a name. Uh, Steven Vogt, Silver. We got to start stacking our bullpen now. So if you take a Silver here, we'll have a Gold and another Silver. We have to hope a Silver pitcher. I don't want to have a Bronze in the bullpen, so we are going to have to go with Corey here for the bullpen. And hopefully the bronze will be a position player. There we go. Uh, we could use a backup catcher. I don't imagine we'll have to use him. But now we'll have a gold. Oh, yes. Now we'll have a gold in the pen and then a silver to round it out in, oh, Hector Neris, 964, Garrett Whitlock. Oh, God. Never mind. I thought I did much better with these guys. We're going to go Andre here. Uh, Player Lock League. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Let me just get everything organized um, on this squad. And we will go play some games. I really like this team. I like this team a lot, to be honest with you. Very, very good stuff that we have right here. I am, I'm a big fan of this team. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, Angel. Thank you so much for hanging out today. I appreciate you. And hopefully, I will catch you on Monday. All right, so that's organized. All right, so we need KJ comes out for Arroyo. And I believe that's the only move we had to make. Good. I, I like Ryan off the bench here. Okay, so how are we going to organize everything? We have quite a team here. We have quite, quite a team. But only three lefties, so we're going to be a little bit strategic about this. So I'm thinking we don't really have a true leadoff hitter. That is a problem. That is a problem. A slight problem. Okay, so Sabi's going to bat third. Then Tyler could bat fourth. We can lead off with Xander. We can lead off with Xander. Then we go righty. Then we can go lefty with Jack Peterson. Then we have uh, Patrick Wisdom. Ah, uh, no, no. Switch Patrick Wisdom and Christian. And then we'll have back-to-back -back righties. And then another righty. So that's the hard part, is when we get to the, the pitcher pinch hitter spot, we're, we're going to have basically four straight right-handers. But I think... I know this is a pretty solid uh, lineup, especially when your when your seventh hitter is batting three ninety three. Um, I like that a lot. I I like this team a lot. What do y'all think? Any any possible changes, or else we're gonna start loading up into the games. You want a royal to lead off? I was considering it. Uh, move him and Xander around. I'm gonna give Xander the lead off spot for right now. Um, if I have to change it, I will. If I have to change it, I will. Let's go, Grizzy. I do want to try for this first one. See you on Friday, Angel. Monday, there's still Friday and Saturday. You're right, there is. 
You're right, there is. I was looking at the calendar today and I know my, my semester just started, but I'm already in like what, week five? Yeah, I'm already in week five. One, two, three, yeah, week five. And my spring break is that first full week in March. So March 4th is my last day of class before spring break for a week. We're almost halfway there. You know, it's a 16 week semester. Well, 17 weeks if you count spring break and then finals at the end. You know what I'm saying? But we're almost through the first eight weeks of the semester. So it's going to be spring break before we know it. Then streams will be back to six days a week for just a week. And then summer will come. That eighth semester flies. It does, though. It does. All right. We are going to start with Andre here. I am a simple man, so what I'm asking for 22 is that Frank Schwindel, Schwindel is still referred to as number 18. I will do my best to call him that, um, if you will, Senor Nerd, when you are here. But like, you, you gotta pronounce that last name. It's, it's so German and it's so incredible. I, I think my opponent might be in the bathroom right now. I, I hear no movement on their end in picking a pitcher. So I might back out of here in two seconds and then uh, try to find a new team or a new uh, game. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm gonna go do. All right, take two, take two. Hopefully, hopefully. I'm really excited to recreate the Jurassic Bubble and actually finish the custom stadium this time. It's so incomplete. I started it uh, in May. We started the Jurassic Bubble on my one year stream anniversary stream, and then we never really finished it. And by we, I mean myself. I never finished uh, scoping out and finishing the Jurassic Bubble to all of its potential. So I'm excited to get back into that uh, for 22. Your opponent was taking two. Oh my god. Or are they taking a number two? I hope they wash their hands either way. <laughs> Kappa emo, that's great. Oh, I laughed before I swallowed all of my water, so some of it went to my nose. You know that feeling when you're swimming and then you get water in your nose? That's the sensation I'm feeling right now, and it's not very pleasant. All right, 12 0 run, let's get it. I'm the Kappa emote, that's fun. Should we make an Ashley Kappa emote? It'd be like this. I think. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That hurts. It does, though. That Like, that feeling? It, it's not very fun, unfortunately. 98 and 22. 22. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It feels like a perfect night. You all going to sing along with me? Yeah, water in the nose. I got you. It's weird how much water burns what's in the back of your nasal passage. Exactly. Hey! Is my opponent a White Sox fan? Let's get it. You know, they're playing uh, in the red stadium. stadium. What kind of swing is that? Nope. I love the 83s. I love them so much. Lord Blumpkin. I like that name. That's a cool name. Tyler Naquin, zero batting average. Excuse me, he has a 700 batting average. That's not going to drop like 100 points with that pop out. Got to make sure you use, uh, make use of the right field power alley in Cincy, right? Shout out Dylan Cease for almost getting an oppo taco. Uh, instead, he went three for three with a double at this ballpark earlier in the season. Let that stretch for Salvi. You were saying about the power alley birds? Mm -hmm. You were saying... Wanted to go for that oppo taco. We were unsuccessful, unfortunately. Whip Merrifield to start the lineup. Perfect. Here, Mondesi. Go to leadoff, guys. Um, if they're drafted in the squad. If Whip Merrifield wants to come to the White Sox via a trade, I'd be okay with that. Did he just give up on the baseball? How? What? You what? How do you know what? How do you not catch that? That's a leadoff hit. Tough. Power alleys don't work when you collapse your back legs, silly. I know you didn't say the silly, but I, I added it just for emphasis. I know, I know. I know, I know. You had tacos yesterday? Oh, Yo, man. what kind of tacos, Packers? Were they good? Were they delicious? You you really can't go wrong with tacos, typically. One ball, one Unless you do, then that's not very fun. All right, we got to switch in that cutter if we can. All right, stolen bag. Uh, proved well right there. 
It's only one out, runner on third now. I said in my head, so I'm concerned that you're reading my thoughts. That's because I am reading your thoughts. What? Mm -hmm. What? 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 Perfect throw home, though 74 speed. Wait, dang it. If he had a oh better arm strength. Oh, that would have been so cool. That was a perfect throw. Didn't have the arm strength to get wit at the plate, though. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Oh, one's the oh, that's fun. Let's just forget that then, Eric. On my side of things. Homemade tacos? Nice. Red Stadium White Sox Union's opponent is confusing me. So how we doing? If it's inappropriate, I can report it. No, not team. PSN. Eh, they'll look at it. This noodle arm brought to you by Fazoli's Fast Food Italian. Like I said, I... My cognitive ability today is is exhausted. It has been exhausted. I had an exam this morning and a presentation, so. Usually I catch that and I obviously did not. Yo, what's up, Jay? I'm doing very, very well. How are you? Thank you for asking. I got to count one yeah, exactly, Eric. Thank you for understanding. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gotcha, Larry. I don't know why Automod got you there. You're good, you're good. Do I want some baked chicken? I had chicken yesterday. I think we're having pasta for dinner today. Give me some pasta, which I'm excited about. Doing good. Love to hear that. <gasps> is that Raven? Raven is on my bed. And she is incredible. We went 2-0, Cameron. And so we switched on over to BR for the last hour or so or stream. He's out. Can always bop on the CPU. That's true. We should work on our parallel grind today. We haven't done a good bopping on the CPU in a while. Hmm. Instead of redrafting this team if we lose, maybe we will do that. Maybe we'll do a parallel oh, grind um, to end today's stream for the God Squad. I like that idea. Thank you for reminding me that I can do that, T-Red, because I forgot. We'll see. We'll see. It's up a comeback season right now. Ooh, very slow. We're going to take second right there, and we're going to be safe. He's safe. Spring training likely delayed. Absolutely. What kind of pasta? I'm not sure. Pasta, and your right fielder has a noodle arm. Hope you aren't a cannibal. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no, no. All right. I do need to warm up the bullpen, though, real quick. So I'm going to spend some time doing so. How does one forget? I, like I told you, my brain is wiped right now because of school this morning. I'm just, I'm just vibing, I guess you can say. I'm, I'm just vibing. There's, there's, there's nothing going on in here, which is very, very rare for me. All right, we stay alive. Let's go. Come on, Patrick. Got to capitalize. Come on. Hits aren't there. I think we do need a bop on some uh, rookie CPU. Does anyone know what Manfred announced today? He, he's talking on Thursday, Cameron. Come on, Bonk. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I think yeah, there was one hydrate. Actually, there was a hydrate I missed because they were all back to back. Let me go call it out here. I think it was a Renegades hydrate. There we go. Renegades, in case I missed it. I got you. Yo, what's up, Landon? Welcome on in. Roger Clemens to the show. Rocket to the show. Do you want to see Clemens in this game? I mean, what do you think about Johnson and Howard, Jay? We, we haven't had the chance to talk about it. What do you think? I am a big fan. Big, big fan. That's a nice out. Manfred gonna talk about his new fishing boat. He's like, well, I want baseball to start on time. It's the players who aren't doing anything. So you're not fooling anyone. You're not. <sighs> Disrespect. Disrespect. Want someone new? Johnson and Howard are new. What do you mean? you want someone new or do you mean you want like more new people because yes i would agree oh today's not thursday no worries cameron it is tomorrow but we're getting there we are getting there you're hoping johnson throws 102 oh he will he will there's there's no reason why he won't at least like his end game card i'm personally predicting he's going to be a series of cards his end game card will absolutely have outlier yes more new people there we go there we go you wish today was Thursday, that means tomorrow would be Friday, right? Logic holds. 
what's Friday? It's this thing at the end of the work week. Not for everybody, though. And then you eat french fries. And then you eat french fries. If you don't eat french fries, oof, you gotta go to jail. Never heard of it. Speaking of throwing 102, I hope they adjust outliers so a pitcher isn't throwing that speed the entire game. I agree. I hope there's some realistic aspect brought into that for that change. Randy Johnson will be the first player to have outlier on a slider. Do you want to see this 80 mile per hour slider? Got the job done, did it not? Who needs outlier on sliders? Yeah. <laughs> Taco's like, Ashley. <laughs> French fries are to be eaten daily. Now that, yes, I agree. Psh, I work Friday and Saturday, so it's not the end of the work week. True, 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 true. LOL, Randy Johnson, Ryan Howard. Imagine Randy's just a rookie card. Oh, people would be so mad. I mean, he'll probably start as a rookie card or like a veteran card. But yeah, thank you, Larry. They absolutely are. Both mine and my opponents for once. Jail for no fries? Yes, that's how serious I am about everyone making sure they, they have the pleasure of eating french fries every week. Oh, and one. Yes, Clemens in 22, either signature awards or milestone. Uh, 4,000 strikeouts, 300 wins. But fish and french fries, also known as fish and chips, are for Fridays. I've never had fish and chips. One ball, I mean, count. yeah. You just want a slider to be nasty? Oh, it will. I mean, you see how they have Chris Sale's slider in this game. It's going to be Chris Sale's slider more disgustingly, you know? You don't like french fries? <gasps> I love how Automod caught that. I will gladly eat your french fries. I will. What kind of alien are you? Randy would be a moments card, you think? I don't know. He could very well be a collections card for all it's worth. That was so funny, Valencia. He's out. Give me curlies anytime. Curly fries are French fries. They're just the curly version. So you do like French fries. And yes, curly fries are the best French fry. I would agree. They are French fries. You want an Ichiro card, Rookie of the Year, MVP card? Yes. Sign me up. Tony Strikeout might be the first moments card. It very well could be. Supposedly, says Valencia. <laughs> Gri Grizzy agrees. I agree. There's so many variations, my guy. Steak, curly, onion. You have to like something. It looks like he likes curly. And this should be a homer to tie the game for Xander Bogarts. Don't you dare give me a warning track pop. Okay, who wants to bop on the CPU and uh, and work on our parallel stats? There's a glitch in the system. I'm not being crying. I was doing homework when I missed. I scored up a ball perfectly and it went 403 feet and not 404 feet for the homer Tar Heel. We don't talk about BR Bruno, no, no. We don't talk about Bruno, but it was my wedding day. Tommy Edmund is a 200 uh, hitter offline. Oh my God, Tommy, what are you doing? You're, you're literally hitting 350 online. Okay, that will help. That will help. That will help. Error 404, Ashley not found, pretty much. Pretty much. Tommy going for the triple. Tommy's going for the triple. We're just gonna get, we're just gonna P5 our God Squad. That's what we're gonna do for the next 45 minutes. We're gonna P5 our God Squad. We just destroying the computer now, you know it. You're just, you just saw uh, Encanto yesterday. You really like it. Encanto oh, is no so way. good. I, I've been obsessed with the soundtrack. I, I've been listening to it uh, to and from school every single day. Oh, Wendy's is so good. I dislike people. Which people are you disliking today there, JH? Play the prison? No, thank you. I was concerned by the length of the silence. Thought the non-French fry aliens got her. That too. That definitely contributed to it. 
But I don't know how that baseball... I know it's Xander Bogarts. I know, but he squared it up. At least don't want to go that far and get my hopes up. Dang it, Trouty. That's a sack fly. Probably, LMAO. We don't talk about Bruno. No, no. Bring the doctor back in the show. Doc Gooden. How about a Doc Holiday? <gasps> what if Holiday was in this game? That'd be incredible. The Rockies have been through so much pain this year, being crushed time after time. Time after time. Now, now I'm, uh, uh, I have uh, um, Anne and April singing that song in my mind from Parks and Rec. Uh, Lendova, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. I appreciate you being here. Because I'm coming in hot. Doc Holiday needs to be in this game. Hey. With uh, Howard and Johnson being announced, I absolutely have hope for Doc Holliday being added to the game. Looks like they're going all in. Bryce Harper, baby! Talk smack so I will ruin his day. Oh my god. <laughs> JH, you're funny. I always bop on the Orioles that ship it. It's fun for me. Hey, your Orioles that ship it is my Iraqis at Coors Field. At Coors Field, excuse me. I feel you, Tar Heel. It's a great stress relief. Have you ever had smiley fries as a kid? Yes. And then my friend was like, um, mo like smush them in ketchup so the ketchup would come out of the eyes and the mouth. And I was like, are you okay? Do it next time you have smiley fries in case you had it. It's, it's quite murderous. That's tough. That's tough. <laughs> Get him hell, buddy. <laughs> Gonna find his stream. Oh my goodness, JH. Please don't do anything you'll regret. Good vibes, good vibes. Everyone has to beat on my O's. That's why I beat on the Rockies for you, Taco Cat. I got you. I got you. Yo, what's up, Ram? Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. The alerts have been off and on today. Hopefully, it will pop up soon. If not, I appreciate you being here. Counts one and oh. If you want, if you're lost, you can look and you will find me. Time after time. Yo, there we go, Ram. I appreciate you being here. Thank you so much, uh, Meat Tram. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Need to lower testosterone. <laughs> Used to tear them apart. Ashley is the nicest. I got you, Taco. I got you. But if you're a Rockies fan, I don't got you, unfortunately, in these games. <laughs> Though, um, I'm I'm trying my hardest to make plans to see the White Sox when they're in Colorado. Um, if everything schedule-wise is the same. Uh, my friend's family uh, recently moved just outside of Denver, and, and the White Sox are in Colorado, Denver. Um, at the end of July, for uh, just a two-game two, two game series, but two games nonetheless. So I really want to make it out there, as well as to San Diego for the White Sox Padres, as well as TwitchCon. I'm starting a petition for my own personal edit button so I can fix my typos. It bothers me that they just exist forever. I feel that, though. I can always delete the comments. I can do that going forward for you. I got you. But then then your stats might be affected. I'll, I'll click on your name. It'll be like, you have deleted 9,900 comments or chats from birds. And I'll be like, whoa, what did birds do that made me delete all of these messages? I'm kidding. It doesn't tell me that. <laughs> Sit in the purple seat so you're exactly one mile above sea level. I'm always one mile above sea level. I don't even know what that means, but I said it. Uh, let's cross our fingers for Mario Kart 9 announcement in the next few hours. Yes! I was so sad. I thought I was going to miss it because of stream. I had the times wrong. I had the time wrong. Oh, that was such a late swing. But it's going to be a hit, if not a homer. Nope, it's going to be... A We're going to go for three. We're going to go for three. Cody B, get on your horse, Cody B. I should. I should have sent him home. I, I should have seen if he would have gotten the inside the parker right there. Come on, Yasmani. Yasmani's already P5. We should probably have switched somebody maybe in here. Ball, Ashley partakes in things illegal in Illinois, but not in other places. That's the only thing that I think that could mean. Maybe. I don't know. I'm a very legal person, I guess. I don't know. I'm in my bed at 9.15 on a Friday night sometimes. because I'm just so tired. And then I watch Brooklyn Nine-Nine. And then I'm happy. <laughs> Um, little Rudd, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Hope all is well, oh, Billy. Yep, I thought it was in the morning, but the direct's in 30 minutes, so yeah, us. Let's go. Right when stream ends, basically. Might have to end stream like five minutes early then. Oh, come on, Corbin! It's gonna be a... Sack ground out. RBI ground out. Thank you, Red Sox guy. Brooklyn Nine-Nine is amazing, right, Jimmy? I'm watching it for the first time ever. I have about 20 episodes left, so please don't spoil it. 
and I literally laugh hysterically when I'm watching this. And, and most of the times I'm watching it like in the evening, like at night, I'm in bed like right before I'm, I'm going to sleep. So like my family is asleep and I literally have to will myself to stifle the laughs um, or else I would wake everybody up every single episode I'm watching. Nine nine, cause bed at nine thirty checks out with the effects. It honestly does though. It's got to be super smash card for the switch. Ooh, that'd be incredible. That was a great swing for Trouty. Not sure you were picking up what I was putting down. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> gotta gotta refocus the brain for tonight. I will. All you need to know is the heist episodes are the best. Oh, 100 percent Oh my god. Don't even get me started on the Jake and Amy heist episode. Oh my god. I like squealed. I'm like, that is the greatest thing ever. Oh. I I was like, oh my god. I'm a hopeless romantic at heart. So as I was watching that episode, I was like, oh my god. It was awesome. You haven't seen Brooklyn Nine Nine? I would highly recommend it. It is on Hulu. I get Hulu in my student Spotify bundle. Dang! You know what's gonna stink? Yep, when you're no way. longer a student, you got you don't get the student discounts. Grad school? Where are you at? Ball, that's out. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Peely? Did we see the new MLB The Show post? You know we did. The trailer are you referring to this morning? Unless there's another post like right now, which I don't see a notification for because of course. I, I, I have their, uh, their noties on. Um, I'm the least romantic person. I don't know why my oh, wife my likes me. <laughs> respect, respect. Hey. My wife and I were working our way through it, then our youngest stopped sleeping, so it's on hold. Dang it, Lenny. You just, you just gotta look at your youngest and be like, look, kid. Maybe not in that tone, but you go, look, kid. Oh. There's this TV show that makes mommy and daddy very happy. And you make us even more happy, but this is a different happiness that can't be messed with. You go sleep sleeps so we can watch an episode or two before we have to go sleep sleeps. That's what I say to my cats when they wake up. I go, do you have good sleep sleeps? I recommend the, the terminology catch on. Giannis dad jokes after games are fantastic. Oh my God, they crack me up. I live for his dad jokes. Uh, one community college class per year will give you the discount. Hey, there you go. There you go. The learning never stops. Look at all these triples. No, How many perfect games have you thrown against the Rockies? <laughs> a lot. You'll try that tonight. Let's go, Lenny. You can you could just clip this stream if you want, and then just show show me saying it to your child. No, your kid will be like, "Who's she?" I, I don't want to scare any children. You know what's up, Carrot? Sorry I haven't been able to be here as often. I've been very busy with school and my new video game reselling business. But now that things are starting to calm down, I hope I'll be able to tune in more often. Carrots, you never have to apologize for that. I'm glad to hear that you are thriving. And I appreciate you being here whenever you're able uh, to be here. So thank you for being here. And I'm glad to hear all as well. This homer is for you, my friend. Welcome back on in. Uh, Peely, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Let's go. Wait, cats sleep? Mookie just runs around my chest all night, every night. They, yeah, they do that too. All right, mission outscore Ashley versus the CPU is on. Dang it, I'm only at six runs in the third inning. We got to at least get to like 12 right here. 365th person gets Stanton to P4. Let's go, Jay. How many, how many of them have P5? Get that grind on. Bloop, bloop. Dang it. I want all of the bloops. All of the time. You watch Twilight before? It's so good. Twilight is one of my guilty pleasure movies. Monster shot. You know it, Thundercats. <gasps> hi, Mi Do you want to say hi to stream? We have a Mi Moomoo appearance. Cat cam. Isn't the Elgato face cam on sale right now on Amazon? That might become, or this will become our cat cam, and that would become my face cam. We'll see. We'll see. 93, you want to get him before 200? Respect. You're 1.7k out of 2k for Simeon P4. He's your next P5. Wow. You don't even have Simeon as a P5. Tarheel, I don't think I can talk to you in, until you make that happen with, with how much you hype him up. Tarheel, I, I gotta bid you in a, I have to bid you in a do right here. You once made the CPU use its whole bullpen. There we go, Grizzy. The Elgato face can. I think that has to be the cat cam. Get it? Get it? Elgato. That's that's cat and span. Yeah. Honestly, though. And it would make sense for the cats to have, like, the better quality camera than me, so. And this one works fine for me. You can see me in clear. You know, 1080p. 
Uh, this is only 30 frames per second, though, because it is 1080p. The Logitech C922, but it's it's served me very, very well. But cat cam has to happen. You almost have Ripkin to P5. It'll be 26 if you get him soon. Let's get it, Taco. See, your Orioles always have Ripkin's history. And the White Sox and a 1983 team do as well. So it is tough. A do is a favorite word of mine in Wordle. You play. I do not play Wordle. I feel if I did, I would be way too addicted to it as, as an English major who loves words. <laughs> so, yeah. So, yeah. I mean, we enjoy hanging out with you, but we are really all here for the cat content, and I don't blame you one bit. Honestly, I'm here for the cat content, too, and I need to up my game for the streaming cat content, you know? I, I do enjoy the Jack appearances, because Jack, Jack likes being held. Uh, Maleficent, Moo Moo, and a Coach Raven do not like being held. But I, I try to give them on stream when I can, of course. But I agree. You can only play one word per day, so it's a safe addiction. Interesting. All I want for the show 22 is David Wright, nothing else. You gotta get the captain of the Mets in there. Absolutely. It's once a day. It usually takes you less than five minutes. How addicted can you be? Hmm. I can do it when I wake up in the morning. Or before I go to bed at night. Keep the brain sharp. Your cat's name is Wolf. Love it. We have Jack and Moo Moo and Coach. Or Jack, Maleficent, and Raven. Which they all have nicknames. Like, Jack is Snacky. Like, Baby Snacky. Because he's a snack. Not in a cannibal way. Because he's a snack. Because he's cute. Um, Maleficent is Maleficent. Because it's a dope name. Uh, but she's a little cow. So we call her Moo Moo. And then Raven is Raven. Because she's a raven. But she's coach. So she's coach. End scene. <laughs> Every time you see Coach Raven, I'm tempted to call her John Harbaugh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but she's better than any coach. Even though John Harbaugh does have a Super Bowl. Raven has a Bucks championship. Now she needs a White Sox World Series and a Packers championship. Oh, please don't be thrown out at second. Oh, they went... Oh. Nope, go back to second. Uh, who do you want to see in the Diamond Pre-Order cover athlete pack? Well, uh, Ryan Howard. Wait, was, was, wait, was Ryan Howard a cover athlete? Maybe he wasn't. Who were the cover athletes? So obviously we'll have Shohei, we'll have Tatis, um, Javi Baez, Bryce Harper, um, um, Robert, uh, not Roberto Clemente, wrong pirate, Ashley, Andrew McCutcheon, excuse me, Joe Maurer, uh, if he's back in the game, I know many people would be excited for that. All of the covers, all of the covers. Yeah, Howard was, yeah, Maro too, Maro too. Yeah, Howard was 06, thank you, thank you. I just didn't play in 06, I, so, no, I, so I did not know if I remembered that correctly. Your dog's name is Riley Noise. Wolf and Riley, I like it. A White Sox what? I don't know, what did I say about the White Sox? A White Sox World Series! Come on, Eric, aren't you a Cubs fan? Get out of here, Eric. I'm just kidding, you can stay, but. How old is Coach? They turn, oh my God. They turn three in, the, in April. They turn three in April. Dang. Coach, your turn, Momo? You're both in my room right now. Moo Moo, I have like a box in front of my bookshelf and she's sitting on it. It's like just out, it's right here. It's right under this uh, view. And it's, it's like the Twitch partner uh, holiday gift box that I received a little bit ago. Moo Moo's sitting on it and then Raven's laying on my bed. Yeah, their birthday's in April. Well, that's gonna be very exciting. Your cat's like 10, Griffey Jr. All of them, they from the same litter. So Raven and Moo Moo are, li are litter mates. They were found, um, um, they were found on the streets together. In, from the same litter, and we adopted them. Um, Jack, um, he was adopted in 2017. So Jack is going to turn five. Oh my God, Jack's gonna turn five in July. That is why all three are rescues, of course. I don't. We don't really know Jack's origin story. Uh, we know some of Raven and Maleficent's origin story, but uh, we're just very, very happy they have. Nice homes that they're in now. Your cat's a veteran. Are they just counting the show or back when it was 989 sports? That's a good question. Will I ever play backyard baseball on stream? I would love to. I don't know how to play it though, because I don't think it's um, available unless there's like a remake somewhere that someone's created. <gasps> Matt with the 10 month resub. Thank you 
so much, Matt, and welcome back on into the Sam Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges, and thank you so much for double freaking digits emotes in chat for you, Matt. How are we doing? For those of you who do not know, Gorilla Matt is older brother Sam Squad. So if you will, uh, if you want to click that link, drop him a follow. There, there, are, there are more people like me out there, though. I'm unique. Come on. Matt's a close second. <laughs> Carrot sending me back to childhood in one comment, right? Yeah, you can use an emulator. It's just a matter of finding an emulator, like a trustworthy emulator that's not going to crash my PC. Someone had my cat, but you gave him to us because he was supposed to have leukemia. Did he have leukemia? Did he recover from it? Is, is he uh, currently in remission? I'm sure you already talked about it, but what are your thoughts on the new MLB The Show footage? Hyped? Hyped. So hyped. I, I literally, it, the, it was tweeted out like two seconds before I left for school. I was literally on my phone standing in the middle of the family room and mom was looking at me like, what? And I was like, wait, mom, I gotta watch this trailer. And then we saw Randy Johnson and Ryan Howard as two of the new legends. So I am pumped. One ball. Two strikes. I have placed an early bet on you to win the Sanders Family Show 22 tourney. Oh, birds, birds, birds. That's easy money for me, not you. You're going to lose it. I'm going to crush all the siblings. <laughs> but in a good way. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. So right now we're just bopping on the CPU. We are. We're, we went 2-0 and in ranked season today. And now we're bopping on the CPU to uh, up our stats a little bit. I feel confident in second place though, honestly. I think the others will be no-shows. Yeah, you're probably right. I don't think Allie or Tim would play. <laughs> I don't think they would. I love the underdogs. Always a cooler story. I have a cool story. All right, we're gonna power swing here. Let's start power swinging. Get some no doubt animations, if you will. Dang it, I was late. It's gonna fall for a double though. JK, it's caught. I'll play for twin underscore Sanders and get her the dub. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No substitutions. No call-ins. They either show up or they don't. They either uh, lose to me or they don't play me. <laughs> we'll see what we can do there. I want to get the cats. Oh, Moo Moo left, but Raven is still in my room. She rage quit it. That's what she's trying to say. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get myself a new Xbox so I can play a next gen and then of course so I can play Elder Scrolls 6 whenever it comes out Absolutely, then you can create a stadium. You can create your own stadium um, if you get a next gen Xbox Gotta gotta follow one of the uh, release bots. I like Wario 64. Wario 64 is how I got my PlayStation That is literally why I wanted. Yes Why well, we only have 10 runs halfway through this game? We need to at least end this game with 30. If we if we ended it with any less than 30, I'm going to be very disappointed. Oh, yes! Wow. Dinosaurs everywhere. Matt, do you know the name of my stadium? So my team name, I know you know, is the Chicago Bubblegum. My stadium name with all of the dinos is the Jurassic Bubble. Pretty proud of that. <laughs> I want to go 12-0 already. Can MLB 22 come out? Hey. We're getting there April 1st, early, or early access. I was hoping for 10 runs in inning. Me too, Josh. Honestly, me too. I <laughs> love it. I feel like Matt should create the meteor that destroys the dinosaurs for his stadium. I would believe it. He would have it as a background as like a lingering threat to his dinosaurs just to slowly see the panic on their faces. <laughs> you, it really sucks that custom stadiums won't port over to 22. I do agree there. Um, the stadium vault is not going to exist. So you gotta read you all your beloved stadiums. I mean, I'm personally happy that I get to read you the Jurassic Bubble, but like when you look at Captain Tater Tot, if he's still here, or Kasabi, uh, two of the best of the best when it comes to custom stadiums to have all their hard work not transfer over, like that sucks. That really sucks. Have I not seen Jurassic Park? We all know messing with dinos ends well for absolutely no one. I have seen it and I love it anyway. Last time I bopped in the CPU, I scored 20 runs on 12 hits with all the walks you got. Let's go. I think playing MLB with you will help help me get more invested into baseball. I need something to help me get into it besides going to games and eating hot dogs. There's nothing wrong about the latter part though, going to games and eating hot dogs. I won't have my prison. Yeah, that, that's a good thing in my opinion though, Grizzy. I hate that stadium with a passion. With a passion. Mike Trout Oppo Taco. The bops just gotta keep on coming here. Gotta keep on coming. No, says Grizzy. 
<laughs> Ryan Howard baseball card is probably a lot on eBay. You can find a whole lot of baseball cards on eBay for a variety of prices, depending who and what you're looking for. No, you can't, says Grizzy. Oh, but I can. Griffey's three for three. Four for four! Give this man some Wendy's! The kid does it all! Let's go! 444 feet. I love Ken Griffey Jr. There will be enough issues with the stadium creator this year. Flying cameras and a lack of direction. <laughs> this should oh, allow a more sorry. streamlined experience. <laughs> Yo, let's go, senor nerd. What a swing that was. We need to get Ken Griffey Jr. some Wendy's. He's currently four for four. Mookie Bats, why, why you gotta do that, my guy? You're my best player. I don't need you grounding out like that. Central, Mountain, and Pacific time zones will get it on March 31st. <laughs> Pacific is the best. They get it at 9 o'clock on March 31st. And then Eastern gets it at midnight on April 1st. Sucks to suck. No, I'm kidding. Just a little. Gold glove defense? Excuse me? I'm not even replaying that. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Need to change your name to Griffey? Yes, just substitute the Zs for some Fs. Can I get a couple Fs in chat for Grizzy? See what I did there, Grizzy? I wish you held that one-handed finish on No Doubters, right? Get wrecked. Or we can move to New Zealand. True. True, 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 true. Go, pack, go. Hey, let Tatis get a stolen base here. Hey, Cody Bellinger is also three for three. Are we going to get two Wendy's four for fours in the same inning here? First to Griffey, second to Cody B. Oh, let's go. Get down, get down. Four, four, four. Wendy's, if you're out there, we can talk. We can talk. Whoa, I'm just now noticing your logo in the game next to your CBG. How neat. It is very, very neat. You can thank Kasabi and Nikolai for uh, putting the logos in the game. You, you can't just like upload a picture of the logo into the game. You actually have to make it from scratch. And uh, both of those awesome people did. And uh, it is crisp. It is crisp. I always get the family size nuggets uh, from oh, Wendy's and share with my dog. Is it safe for dogs be eating chicken nuggies? Add Wendy's hashtag no free ads. That's what I'm saying though. I get the spicy nuggets, and I'll get like 20 of them, and it's a great time. I love them. Yes! <laughs> you look like Matthew Stafford? Does Matt look like Matthew Stafford? I don't think so. They have, they have different, like, shaped heads. Queen! Hey, we had a comeback queen game. We were down one run in the bottom of the ninth, Matt, with one out. Uh, Tatis Jr. hit a homer to tie the game. Uh, my opponent walked the next batter. And then Yasmani Grandal hit a two-run homer oh. to walk it off. It was fantastic. I found a logo in the vault to use, but whenever I win or lose a game, the box score shows my old logo. Super annoying. Did you um, update it, though, Tar Heel? That could be why. Um, if you didn't change it, that's probably why. That's what I'm saying, Big Dale. But they're still good. They're still good. Hi, Brother Matt. Hi, Sister Valencia. I did. It shows sometimes when not in the box store. That's interesting. Huh. I wonder why. I wonder why. Corbin Burns. He should be very close to P5. Like less than 2,000 PXP I'm talking about. If not closer. So obviously the goal of this is to get our parallel stats up. Please remind me to actually look at the parallel screen. Sometimes when I play these games, I forget to do that small task. Sometimes it just takes a while. Do you think they'll bring back milestone cards in the show 22? Oh, yeah. They were a huge hit this year. They would be very, very silly not to. You're back and better than ever. Yes, Grizzy. You actually did it. Let's go, Grizzy Griffey. You're the bomb.com. You hope the Sixers trade for James Harden? I don't think the Nets are going to allow that trade, at least not in season. Your game the same. It will show the North Stars logo, sometimes wild thing. Interesting. Huh. I guess I never really had to change my logo, apart from, hmm, yeah. Hit, <laughs> hit, and they get hits. <laughs> That's a ball. <laughs> it's holiday season. Drew Holiday is your favorite player too, Red Sox guy. I think, I think a lot of your favorites stem from who are my favorites. But there's nothing wrong with that. But you can always pick your own favorites. I know you're a big uh, Boston Celtics fan. So who's your favorite Celtics player? 
Because Drew Holiday is my favorite. Which is fine. You can be your favorite. But just because he's my favorite doesn't mean he has to be your favorite. Should we try to steal with Tommy Edmund? You know it. You know it! Run, Tommy! He got, like, the slow it. And that's a double play. He got the slowest lead there. The Nets are 100% trading hearted. Do, do you think they will, though? At least in the middle of the season, like, before the trade deadline? Because I feel like they won't. I feel like they would wait until the offseason. I could be wrong, though. But how are we doing, uh, D-Schwag? Hope all is well. I got you, Bunk. There's been a lot of talk surrounding Harden to the Sixers. There absolutely has been. Jason Tatum, noise, noise. The Greek freak is your fave. How can he not be? I mean, he drops 50 points in the finals to win it. And then he orders 50 chicken nuggets and eats them all. Let's go. Okay, we're up to 20 hits, 13 runs, but I need to see 30 runs. Not 13 runs, but 30 runs. Why are my tier 2 emotes adorable? Have you also seen the tier 3? They are, they're incredible. They are incredible. I love them so much. Noise, 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 noise. Ooh, I did not know that, Mace. That's pretty cool. Zach Levine is your favorite? Oh, yeah. He's a big favorite for many Bulls fans. Even people who aren't Bulls fans, I would agree. I did. I just like showing them off all the time, Matt, because I am so very proud of them. I mean, look at them. Those are my cats. Those are their real life faces in my Twitch chats. I love them so much. Bunk LMAO. There it is, Valencia. Oh, wait, says Bunk. Oh my god, is that honestly is one of the best emotes ever? The angry laugh cry. Is, is hands down incredible. Hands down. That's gonna go foul, thank you. Do we have we even a hit yet? Do we have a perfect game going? I haven't really been keeping track of the box score. We do! We do have a perfect game going. And no, me saying that does not jinx this. If we would have given up a hit there, I would have reconsidered. Roger Goodell just, Goodell just announced the games in Germany through 2025. Likely try to get some good press at some point this week. In t oh, wait, games in Germany through 2025. That's pretty dope. It is one, it's a goal of mine to make it out to Germany. Those are my, my ancestors who were. Dang it. Dang it, Bryce Harper. Can we actually get some good matchups overseas? It's because all the good teams don't want to make the travel over there. It's the bad team's version of a Super Bowl. But yes, I agree. We should get some good teams over there. It just messes with travel, though, so much. Hear me out. A card series. That includes players in their last season. Yep, you can't catch that one. Uh, players like Mo Rivera, Buster Posey, and Adrian Beltre. Ooh. That would be interesting. He's not in there? That's tough. Probably more Jags games. Yeah. Sorry, but dogs are way better than cats. Who's trying to compare them? They're two different species. Why are we comparing two different, two different species together? I forgot who said it. I believe it was one of my professors who was like, why, why do we compare dogs and cats? They're two different species. And I was like, you right, you right, you right. But cats are still superior though. They're superior to all species. Let's be real here. I feel bad for any foreigner that experiences their first NFL game. It's Miami versus Jacksonville or something. Absolutely. I love how the game is expanding. Don't get me wrong. But I, I do agree that you gotta also watch the good teams too. You know what I'm saying? Your cats are demons, so I'm kind of biased. Yeah, but they're demons in a good way. They're demons in a good way. <laughs> nah, says Griffey. Exactly. You think they'd send over their best to market their product. That's a oh, fantastic uh, summary, Larry. Absolutely. I would agree. Oh, and two. Nice, Red Sox guy. All right. Cats think they are superior to all species. They are top tier, but chinchillas are number one. But the thing that cats do is they think it and they know it. So they have like a double, double force of being the top species because they think it and they know it. And that confidence alone uh, makes them the top of the top, you know? Cats, superior species based on being looked to as gods. Exactly. And uh, getting okay. championships for their teams. We should just relocate Chicago to Germany, get Bears fans out of here. Hey, I'd be fine with that. I'd be fine with that. Who needs Arlington Heights when you have Germany? Dogs are greater than the end. 
That's because you've never had a cat, Valencia. Aren't you allergic to cats? How how can you say that by following our, all our cat our cat trap friends? I have had a cat. Okay, stand corrected. Dang it. Dang it. I hate when Valencia has has backup. Lions versus Browns in Berlin. The Browns would be kind of dope. Not the Lions, though. Oh, wait, is that official, Bo? LMAO. I'm back. How to get some schoolwork done. No worries, Goose. I, I am very happy. The, the first half of my week was stressful. I had an exam last night. I had an exam this morning. And I had a presentation this morning. Knocked them all out of the park. And now I have a much more relaxed second half of my week, which I'm very much looking forward to. I'm a little burnt out right now for this week. I bring receipts, not empty folders like some people. Drop the rats. Adam, no subtweets. Sandlot, no debate. No, 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 no. A league of their own. A league of their own. And a league of their, a league of their own is not your answer just because you haven't seen it yet. You're ready for the post Rodgers era to begin in Green Bay? I don't think it's going to begin quite yet, though it's definitely still possible. But uh, I don't think Rodgers wants to retire and be in the same draft class as Brady. And literally, there's no better... I mean, besides the Buccaneers. Besides the Buccaneers, there, there's no better option than the Packers. If he goes to the AFC, you have Herbert and Jackson and Mahomes and Burrow. And the list goes on. The NFC is pretty wide open next year. It's pretty wide open. Um, so if he still wants to play, the Packers are his best bet. If he chooses to retire, he chooses oh, to retire. Now. Rogers will go to Denver. Birdman, did you literally not listen to everything I just said about why the AFC is not the place where he wants to go? <laughs> just based on the competition. I mean, if he goes to Denver, he goes for Denver. Then he's just setting himself up for a lot more competition just to make it to the playoffs. But sometimes I feel like I speak and no one listens. Josh Hader, Josh Hader ruined a league of their own for me. He looks just like Kit, the rookie for you. Oh my God, he does. Why did you have to tell me that? I don't think it ruins it, but now I'm not going to be able to unsee it. Huh? What did you say? Have I seen the ESPN top 100 all-time players? Yes, it is quite terrible. Wait, what? Sorry, I wasn't listening. Y'all! I can't. I can't. <laughs> Not gonna lie, though, seeing Mahomes Rogers twice a year would be dope, but wherever Rogers goes, Adams better go too. Absolutely, absolutely. That's a nice GG's. We did not put up at least 20 runs, which is weird. We were shut out from seven, seven, eight, and nine. Ooh. That's because chat was electric. That's okay. All right, let's go look at the parallel stats. I want to see how close Corbin Burns is to a P. I want to see how close Corbin Burns is to a P5. He is a P5. Let's go. Mission accomplished. Hallelujah. Let's freaking go. There he is. You are welcome for putting that in your head forever. Enjoy Brewers games for the rest of his career. Oh my God. I'm so hyped. Hey, and look at Junior and Tatis. Junior and Tatis are very close. Junior is less than 1,000 PXP and Tatis 1,300. Wow. Do you think I'll get some rage quits? Do you think I'll get some rage quits when I load into the game and you see, bam, P5 Corbin Burns? Let's go, nerd. You need to make your own top 100 list and share it with chat. Let us give our thoughts. Ooh, I'll have to take some time to think about that. I like that idea, though. I already have P5 Corby. Welcome to the club. I'm having jackets made. Let's go, Tar Heel. Let's go. All right, everyone. I know we're still a few minutes out from four o'clock, but I want to make sure if you all want to watch the Nintendo Direct that starts in about eight minutes, um, you have the opportunity to. Um, but this was quite a fantastic stream. I appreciate you all appreciate you all being here. We went two and zero in ranked seasons. I will never ever complain about an undefeated day, especially when I was struggling at the plate today. Epic comeback in game two, and then a dominant pitching performance in game one. And then of course we bopped on the CPU and Corbin Burns is our new P5 pitcher. In fact, if he's not in the P5 club already, I need to make sure he's on the P5 squad and he is. Corbin Burns is only my second P5 pitcher. Who would have thunk? That is my ace. Corbin Burns is my ace. I actually want to check these out. So JV is a 375 ERA. Corbin Burns a 313. Logan Webb with a 291. Jacob DeGrom with a 417. 
Felix with a 418. So Felix and Jacob deGrom, they're still getting the work done. It could be a little bit better. These are obviously the top three in the rotation. Logan Webb taking over the ace spot for a little bit over Corbin Burns. Um, but you can never complain about having too many aces. Austin, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. And Matt with the five gifted subs. Great ending. Thank you so much, Matt. Black Diamond, Eric, Grigley, B Killer, and Hoodie. If you're in chat, I need to see all of the thank yous as I welcome you all into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges, but please give Matt a big old thank you. Thank you so much, Matt. I really, really appreciate that hype indeed. With that being said, we're going to go find somebody to raid. I would very much appreciate it if you stick around for the raid. Not only would I appreciate it, whoever we're, we are about to raid, I can only imagine, will also appreciate it. Let me see if we can find somebody new or somebody who we have not raided in a long time. And I know exactly who we're going to go send the love on over to. Please don't spoil the raid. If you spoil the raid, you'll have to be banned, and that's not a lot of fun. Surprises are the best. We're going to send all our love and hype over onto Q. I hope you all enjoy his stream. I will see you back here on Friday for Friendly Friday, so bring your best squads. We might make a theme on Friday. I'm considering an all-switch hitters team. Um, so if you want to play some friendlies on Friday, you can use your normal god squad. That's fine. You can use your theme team squad. That's fine. Um, but I'm thinking we switch it up a bit and we also do a team of all switch hitters i think that'd be really fun toxic fridays they are a treasure i don't want them to be every single friday but we'll bring them back at least one or two more times before the show 22 comes out um i do want to have a toxic friendly friday night stream over my spring break tar heel i got you with the prime time stream i think that would be a lot of fun let's go black diamond i appreciate you mm -hmm. everybody Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all of you. Oh, yeah, I'm talking contact, bunting, um, cheesy swings, replaying uh, home runs. This is my toxic squad, and uh, they're pretty incredible. High contact, high power, high speed. They are r 2 a little bit. But thank you all so very much for watching. As always, please be safe and healthy, especially during this time. And don't forget to be kind. Thank you all so very much for watching. I will see you all Friday afternoon. Finish your week strong. Sand Squad's the best squad. Thank you all so very much.